Space You Know What Do podcast on Riotcast.com. <laughs> What's up? How we doing? All right, we're back. Hey, hey. Another uh, live YKWD uh, on a St. Patrick's Day edition from, yeah. from, from you know what, did you know what, did it, dude? Uh, what is the fuck wrong with the sound on this show? Oh, I thought you were talking about my joke. Sound for the morning. Uh, should we be outside? It's a beautiful day. <laughs> what, what's going on? Do you want to just what's, record this on Lewis Scope? What? What? I don't understand what's fucking happening. Do you hear the clicking? I hear the clicking. I don't hear myself at all. You don't hear yourself. Very slight. Very low on the uh, rattlesnake's microphone. Yeah. Let's keep it that way. Yeah. I don't hear okay. myself either. You don't hear yourself. Yeah, we're all very low now. I except for Adrian. Think of should be low. How's that? Is that better? Hello. Yeah. Hello. That's Is that better? better? Yeah. yeah better. Is that better? Yeah. yeah. Is everybody okay now? Yeah. Do we yeah. have sound in the chat room? In the in the fucking one one one. Is there is there sound in there? Yeah. What happened here? I don't know what the fuck happened. I go away for two. What? Deepu's not here. That's what happened. Deepu's not here. You have fucking Scopo who knows nothing, and you have Lauren who's just fucking easy on the eyes. Fuck you. What? Hey, but that's a compliment. You. Yeah, but you called her just stupid. What? You said she's just pretty. <laughs> That's he a compliment. Say, he didn't say stupid. He said worthless. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we're uh, yes. not just stupid. Yes. There's yeah. a lot of other things yeah. there that you could have read into. People are saying the sound is good. All right. Yeah. 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 Happy yeah. St. Patty's Day, dude. Yeah. Deepu is not needed. All right. Uh, I am Robert Kelly. I am the host, and I am fucking the captain of this vessel. Mm -hmm. Therefore, I have my captain's hat on because ah. I'm running this fucking ship down Funnyville <laughs> River. Yeah. On the east side, motherfucker. Fuck the west side. I'm on the east side on the funny ship. All right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're driving this shit up to the Bronx around the fucking horn. Mm -hmm. And coming back down to Gay Island. Yeah. I mean, we're coming back down to the island to funny where funny lives, bitch. Now we just need about ten people on the ship to move to the other side of the ship to make it even, and we'll yeah, be we okay. Yeah, we saw that coming. Yeah, because it was so you wordy. We, we, are fat. <laughs> I liked it. <laughs> can't write, do a jingle. <laughs> <laughs> can't write, do a jingle. Huh? Uh, all right, so we got on the show today. Of course, we have Aaron Berg. <laughs> Where the oh, fuck is Aaron Berg? He's, he's not here. He's, he's late. Here. This is why he's never going to make it. Yeah. No, he had, a, he had a big audition today. Mm, he had a he's, a, he's the Heineken guy within uh, the Heineken commercial. He's a leprechaun. He's a leprechaun, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's a Jewish leprechaun. Wow. Yeah. That's fucking a big deal. That's cool. I don't now we'll call that a leper kike. <laughs> it's not bad. <laughs> I liked it. I'm just not gonna laugh at it. So oh, <laughs> by the way, last time you weren't here, we also created two other bandanas. We have the ra the race dana, where if you make a racist joke, you get the race dana, and then also the. Uh, what is the race dana? Just a, a pillow sh uh, pillowcase? <laughs> the Confederate flag. Get it? Because it's a hood. Ah, <laughs> all right. <laughs> Good. And then what? the other one was the the stupid dana. Or is if you say is that you're just stupid. your T-shirt? Because <laughs> you're dumb. <laughs> hey, Lewis is dumb. He's dumb. He's dumb. He's dumb. He's dumb as dumb as dumb. He steps in puddles. <laughs> Dude, I'll tell you right now. If you want to save a bad joke, just do a jingle. <laughs> Works every time. I think Mark actually said that, not you. <laughs> but I'm glad you <laughs> took it over as yours, as you do with a lot of things. Um, <laughs> it's a podcast about. All right, anyways. Um, <laughs> Hey, ho, oh, whoa, is that eyebrow sweat you just flicked at me? Yeah. Come on, son, those are fighting words. All right, we got, uh, uh, we got Mark, let's go, let's go to the new guy here, and Juan, <laughs> Antonio, and what the fuck is your Adrian. name? Adrian. Huh? Adrian, Adrian. 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 He's Adrian, but uh, I'm here, sorry. here it's impossible to speak one word in Spanish, so it's Adrian. Now, this is a character? Are you, like, are you working on <laughs> no, something? No, we should tell to people that the iPhones are working well. I speak like this. 
Jeez, I'd rather have Will on right now. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck did you just say? And why do I want to fuck you <laughs> when you say it? He's not attractive, but because of my accent. Voice. Voice he really is. He's a fucking accent. Pablo Escobar, but when he starts talking, <laughs> yeah. he's fucking Antonio Banderas. <laughs> he's, a, he's a fat desperado. <laughs> what, uh, dude, what's up? So where are you from? Argentina. From mm. Buenos Aires. Ooh, Ooh. Bueno, bueno, that's with a B, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Buenos Aires. Bueno. <laughs> so you have Zika. Yeah. We uh, <laughs> we don't, I think. Oh, really? Uh, maybe in the north of Argentina. I don't live there anymore. You'll so, get your country's uh, rich. Yeah. Uh, rich in what? <laughs> in financial it's crisis. Richer than Brazil. Uh, right I, now, yeah. You're, oh, really? It's, it's, it's uh, the, well, the economy's uh, good? Thousands of... No, but... Thousands of Brazilians that were in the streets asking for the president to I didn't quit. hear yeah, what I, the fuck I don't know yeah. what you just said. Yeah. 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 I don't know what my pussy's wet. That's about it. <laughs> Mine is. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Waterfall! Now, yeah, now my chair's wet. <laughs> <laughs> That's Hurricane Katrina. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think we got these oranges? <laughs> me up. Uh, whoa. <laughs> got those oranges. Doesn't work all the time, apparently. You're right, doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't, you can't clap. All. <laughs> Anyways, uh, of course we got Louis J. Gomez, the rattlesnake, the Joan Jett of comedy, the fucking assassin of laughs, the fucking hashtag, the show, the show, from Legion of Skanks, from the Real Ass Dude podcast, from Hammer Fisting, and from. The countdown of Sirius XM Rush 90. God, I'm tired. Jesus Christ. You're like a fucking road middle hack with a lot of credits. <laughs> this guy's done evening at the improv three times. He was on Friday night videos and he did the show with Rosie O'Donnell. <laughs> Give it up for who gives a shit. <laughs> that is the worst when they give you a scroll. <laughs> that was like, pretty Jesus. funny, man. <laughs> 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 Did you like that one? I don't yeah. like it. Can I tell I don't like it? Because right. he was the reason you didn't get the bomb Dana for that fucking diatribe. I got a laugh from fucking uh, my friend over here. Yeah, Nervous Norman's going to laugh at everything you say. Is that his name? Nervous Norman, yeah. He is the furthest thing from yeah. nervous. If anything, he's, he's too confident. Very confident in life. Yeah, yeah. way too confident yeah. in his material. Yeah. Until Sherrod Small has him pressed up against the wall at the comedy cellar. Oh, God. <laughs> fucking, we have to go through that again? Oh, uh, yeah. It was Come on. One. That wasn't fun, was it? Uh, did, you, did your dick get hard a little? <laughs> you can fix the crick in my neck. <laughs> uh, and then, of course, we have Mark Norman, who is one of my favorites. Good to be back. It's uh, and we got Scopo, and we got uh, my my uh, Kelly 2.0, uh, Lauren. Um. Yeah, okay. she's looking good. I was telling her, every, like, I don't know what her boobs are. Some weeks they're massive. Some <laughs> now this week they're like 1978. She got my my mom's tits this week. Right. And, uh, and well. it depends on the bra and the time of the month. Really? Do you yeah. have big boobies or what size are your boobies? Uh, they're like a full C. Oh, oh perfect. Yeah. Like a nice That's C. a Jersey <laughs> titty right That's there. A yeah, yeah. I love a C. Yeah. Yeah. One's He's a, a C good. and one's a B from here. Yeah. <laughs> 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 really <isn't funny>. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Are you talking about my tits or hers? <laughs> oh, I can't see hey, one of hers. Bobby makes fat hey. jokes. All oh, right, well. <laughs> Not all jingles work. Apparently that jingle fucking trick doesn't work all the uh, let's time. Let's kill this jingle bit, guys. <laughs> Good Lord, yes. Well, <clears throat> I, I'm very fascinated that about... The, the, I don't understand. Did you do comedy? You must... Because your accent, you did comedy yeah. in Argentina. Yeah. They have comedy clubs there? Uh, only one. I would say that they're all... Uh, shows in theaters. So why I was I was one of the first guys to have an hour show. Uh, wow. 2007, eight. He's the most famous comic in Argentina. Uh, no, I really, I, I really do. I mean, uh, you so I don't know I, if you can, I, but yeah. are you famous there? No, I am one of the comedians that is uh, that has more name or something like that. But then, why I, would you come here if you're fucking making money there? And their so money's like shittier than our money. Why wouldn't you stay there? It was no kind of, uh, exactly. Uh, I think it was pretty. Fun. Now it's growing. Like mm. now they have TV also. But I left in <laughs> 2008. They got TV within no, the past no, 10 years. No, no, stand up TV, <laughs> my We got water now. They have electricity in the Aircon. <laughs> Aircon. It was too hot. In the favela, they have <laughs> electricity. <laughs> where now comedy, everything is. 
<laughs> See, uh, the people live past 40 now. It is very nice. <laughs> very nice to be a fan. Now that the uh, cartels are no okay. longer <laughs> in control of television. <laughs> okay. This will be long two hours. We got flu <laughs> shots. <laughs> this is going to be a long. This is going to yes. listen, dude. This will be long. Yeah, but then at the end, you now kill all, all of us. So <laughs> <laughs> have that was my plan. Anyway. <laughs> in the coffee. It's in the coffee. Chris <laughs> Coppo is helping me. Whoa. So, uh, hey, one second. Um, hey, welcome to America. <laughs> <laughs> put that right on your I take it, <laughs> put, put that on your That's the bomb that's bandana. It, that's welcome the bomb to bandana. the show. Put that on your what, microphone. What did you do with these? Lewis, tell him. If you, every time you tell a bad Lewis joke, speak Spanish. Yeah. Uh, I, I take it. I take it. I take it home. Yeah, no, you don't, no, 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 no. Don't listen, take it home. My family, no. my family will like it. <laughs> put it on, no, put put on your, your microphone. You put it on your mic. This is pretty big. It's kind of like to do a tent. In this country, they put <laughs> the <walls with> <laughs> no, put that on your microphone. Uh, yeah, Explain yeah, to him, would you? Yeah, if you bomb a joke, you get the bomb Dana. No, you'd have to put it over ah, it, okay. just around it. No, not over oh, it. Jesus Christ, oh, give boy. me the bomb Dana. <laughs> <laughs> I, I suppose that you cannot talk. There, there, there you go. go. No, it, no, it's just so the fans watching know, know who had the last shitty joke. Oh, okay. Don't worry, I'll get it back. <laughs> we'll all get it. We'll yeah, get we'll, it. we all get it. So but, anyway, so yeah. uh, uh, I left like and I started doing stand-up in Spain. That in they Spain. have a much bigger market there. Like yeah, they, the they black, have TV. The they black, have TV there. Yeah, they have so, the Black uh, Cliff Pig, too. Uh, no, they have uh, Comedy Central and Paramount. Yeah. And so you can tour all around the country with an hour show. Right, yeah. A lot. Like 30 and, or 40 gigs. And now, uh, can I ask you a question? You do 30 or 40 gigs. Now, are you yes. getting great money? Uh, you get something like you don't uh, have to tell me three, you, uh, yeah, yeah, you don't yeah, have to tell you, me you exactly. Get, yeah, yeah, yeah. But you, is it thousands? I want to know exactly. Uh, it depends if you tour. Yeah. How is much it, for yeah, one yeah. hour? So yeah, is yeah. It yeah. One How hour. much for an hour? If you're doing an hour, thirty shows, you're making three grand a night. Three year, three thousand euro. No, no. A thousand euro. No. Yeah, well, yeah, you could. Yeah, you could, depending on the gig. Okay. Uh, I would say that the floor is three, four hundred euros for a theater show. Uh, uh, um, or a bar show. Or a bar, or a bar show. show. That's, about, that's about the same here. For okay, so now you know. go around there, you do all this stuff in, in Spain, and yeah. then what makes you come to New York City? The it motherfucking... Was chance. I, I, I uh, translated five minutes in English, and I went to a mic, and someone saw me, and said, well, you could do this here. So I came there... Ten months after I did it again, someone saw me until in 2011 I passed the comic strip. And then I got a artist visa, the O1 visa, uh, for three years. Well, yeah. why, why wouldn't he come here? I mean, he's got the accent, he's a minority, it's a huge thing. Yeah, I tell you, show there he is, yeah, look at him. 100%. I'll tell you this. Wait, was that the Heineken leprechaun? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's going to change into his outfit. <laughs> oh, please do. Good Lord, love to see a jig. I, I, excuse well, me. We don't have black guys Whoa, on the show. Jesus, <laughs> Lewis. What? I, That's the racist uh, Dana. Can you, can you learn how to be can subtle I, I'm with a ra race Dana? Can you, where is it? <laughs> hey. Can, dude, can you fucking be subtle with your racist joke? Oh, that's please? right. It's yellow. It's the chink, Dana. Oh, God, forget time. it. Right. I'm not even talking to you. What? You really are just what? taking Dude, no one's safe. No. <laughs> hey, so <laughs> it it is true though. He's you, a shoe in. Well, nowadays you have to fucking every show it has to have a minority. Yeah. It's it's fucking that's it. It's crazy. That th that's it. If you're a TV show, you have to have minorities in it. Yes. That's we were, it. We were just talking about how Greece, they did a re replay of yeah. Greece and they had like black characters. It's well, the 50s. Wasn't it all black characters? No, no, no. no, no, no. Well, also at the same time, there are too many comedians now. It's uh, <coughs> If you're a white dude between 20 and 50, you really need a very special voice. You need a to hook be out or there. Yeah. It sucks. So with me, I, I don't feel that it's like that. I, I feel that no one is looking for an Argentinian comedian, but then when they look, it's only one. I, I, uh, well, <laughs> I'm no answer. one's looking for a comedian that you can't understand any of his jokes. <laughs> take the Whoa! take the bomb. Take the bomb. <laughs> That's Indians. Oh, no, just, what, are you, what are you fucking? <laughs> Wow. Uh, Aaron Berg is at the <laughs> fucking table. Everybody. Enter during the what burial the boat lift. <laughs> First of all, Cuba. dude, fuck you. Thanks, and whatever right. you're wearing. Thank you. I appreciate you it. Don't fucking flex your titties. 
Look at Lauren's all fucking hot and bothered now. Look Where at you. Oh, what hey, do you Lauren. think? Where is she? Oh, yeah. She's right over here. Good to see you. I didn't see you behind that screen. Uh, what does that mean? What does that fucking uh, that that symbol mean? White power. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, it's, uh, it's the Trump it's for Hebrew. president. Yeah, it's Hebrew. No, I know it's Hebrew. It's uh, to life. About... L'chaim. To life. L'chaim. 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 Yeah, you got it. I get it. Shabbat shalom. You look good, um, Bert. Yeah, you look nice, real man. good, dude. Fuck you. My, my hey, cholesterol. Bert just, Bert just got roof. engaged. Yeah. Whoa! What's his name? Whoa! <laughs> He works at Tony. Uh, William Morris. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he promised me citizenship. And a Heineken commercial. <laughs> yeah, and a Heineken spot. You got you're a yeah, leprechaun. I got engaged like uh, three weeks ago. Hey, Holy congratulations, shit. man. Thanks, man. Wow. Yeah, thanks. That's awesome, man. Congratulations. Now, now how, how'd, you, how'd you ask her? I wrote a, a letter, like, not a letter, like, what are you, a queen? <laughs> please find this. What are you, Abe Lincoln? <laughs> yeah. I, I met you one time under an apple tree. <laughs> in that day, I knew <laughs> you were to be mine. Why'd you write her in cursive or print? Uh, in print, but my print <laughs> handwriting's not that good, so I just wrote, like, a <laughs> like list a of all the things that I you, love about stop, her. Stop, one second. Yeah. You didn't fucking, like, type it out? You wrote it? Yeah, I wrote it. Hey, in, wrote it. Can I see your print? It's really bad. Can I Bobby. see what it looks like? Yeah, give me so, some. So when she there. shows your kid later in life, your kid's going to be like, what retard wrote this yeah. to you? Yeah. So the, the <laughs> point was at the end of it, it wrote, like I wrote this list of everything I loved about her, and then it said more to come, but she couldn't read it, and she goes, more taco me? And then, <laughs> so, oh, oh, that shit. Yeah. And then she started, <laughs> and then she started, started laughing, and then, uh, and then I gave her the ring, and then uh, she said yes. And now, and now it's a debacle trying to plan a. I thought you just get engaged and you go get married. No, 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 no. It's no. a big fucking to do. Uh, I'll tell you, yeah. it, when I did oh, it. Yeah, man. You it's got a, married? Yeah, yeah. yeah that, that was a worse proposal than mine. And mine he, was bad. I tried to kill her. Why are you just? What? I literally, I tried. I, 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 I was trying to propose. When, when he gets married, they have to kill animals. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I slaughtered no, no, three goats in front of her and I, drank the blood. <laughs> what are he, Count Dracula? <laughs> None of us do accents. <laughs> Where's Dan, Dan Soda? Yeah, Where's listen. Soda you need him? Count I tried to drink the blood. He's from Argentina, not Transylvania, you fucking heeb. <laughs> so yeah, yeah, because I, I, we were uh, traveling back and forth. My wife is Norwegian. Oh wow! Yeah. Uh, so uh, you fucking asshole. At some moment, I, I thought, well, fuck it, I will propose. And I bought a ring in Argentina, and I, and, and we met in Istanbul. We met in Turkey. You went out and you fucking found that that. Uh, that that stone in the mountains of your country, didn't you? Yeah, it was I, I went diamond. there. I was hunting, and I was hunting animals, and I went for the stone. That's the perfect stone. Anyway, what are you? Why are you so Jewish? Now? Right. Yeah, I, I can't get it. <laughs> you can't even do your own accent. <laughs> yeah, I am Jewish. I was I in the stone, Jewish. and I said, "What? What do you want? <laughs> I will give this to my wife if you if you tell the jaguar to back off." <laughs> what the fuck happened? So, uh, are you Jewish? I am. Oh, Whoa! Oh. What? Is it mixing it up? Dude, Lachayam. Yeah. Am. yeah. I am. Are you oh, really? Yeah, on that side. Yeah, a lot of Jewish uh, people in Argentina. Not yeah. a lot. Uh, I think it's a third or fourth population. I thought he was going to say 30. Yeah. I think there's 30 or 40. <laughs> <laughs> well, then, here's, the here's why that fascinates me. Because you think of uh, Jewish people, you forget it's a religion. You know what I mean? You think, oh, you're Jewish. That's not a, a I think people. A That's a religion. You know, oh, Jesus <laughs> Christ, Lewis. <laughs> What the fuck, man? What? I'm being honest. That's what this is about, this show. <laughs> honest conversation. Uh, so it is weird that there are, of course, there's, there's Christians. You think, I would think you guys would be more Christian because they conquered you back in Listen the day. Look, we have Christians, we have Jewish, and we have Nazis in the South. You have Ooh. Nazis? Still. What do you mean Nazis? Right. South America got a lot of Nazis. Yeah. Uh, really? Yeah. Hitler, I didn't fucking know Hitler that. Oh, yeah. That's good. It's very diverse. Yeah. Wait a minute. So, stop. Are they, are uh, they Nazis I like... Say, I I don't remember the last time. Well, uh, what was... Uh, did they have this a famous Nazi? Was it the movie Hitler? with uh, What's Schindler's that? List? Uh, well, this was this famous book that Hitler was living in the Ooh. south of Argentina. Yeah, they, they, do a, they did a movie, uh, like that. A TV show about Boys in Brazil. Was something like that. Brazil? Yeah. And you could see mm. people from the countryside. Say, yeah, yeah, he was living here, you know, like uh, Adolfo. <laughs> like it was a crazy thing. Yeah, could you do me one fit? Don't ever do your accent. Okay, <laughs> I will know. <laughs> yeah. He doesn't need to do that. Just, yeah. yeah, you can just talk like you. We get it. Yeah. Okay. You don't have to do it. So, uh, what, what, what was the name of a <laughs> super famous? Yeah. They, they got a super famous uh, Nazi. 
the uh, Hitler, the legend. Thirty years yeah. ago, no, no, but he he was taken to Israel. And Vos he was executed. Blubik. Oh, good. Uh, Vandersloot. I don't know. Why don't you Google it, you <laughs> fucking yeah, Nazi this, hunters? St can uh, I stop for one second? I, stop I, listening to the show and fucking work. She's working. Yeah, she is. Work it, girl. Ah. Oh. All right, go ahead. Keep he, he should be, when he hears yeah. something, we're like, what is it? He's supposed to see that beautiful thing, yeah. that new keyboard and the mouse. Yeah. yeah, he's supposed to go, oh, I got it, and then where go, hey. Where yeah. is he court? Argentina or Brazil? Uh, in Buenos Aires. Buenos Aires. All right, Buenos go ahead. Aires. And he was under a fake identity, and the Mossad went, and they did a huge yeah. operation, and they took him. And Oh, yeah, I remember that fucking movie. Yeah, I think it's Robert Duvall, the, the main character. I think it's Adolf. Eichmann. Yes. Adolf exactly. Eichmann. See how Thank fucking you. good that was? Adolf yeah. Eichmann. Yeah. Number on top, one Eichmann. And on top of that, you sound smart. Like, yeah, you know. You yeah. know I, I'll allow you not to say that you Googled it. I'll allow you just to go, it was Adolf. Like, people well, are like, whoa. Yeah. Like the fans. One camera. Is there okay. one good right. Adolf on the okay. planet? <laughs> There's no there good Adolf. No. no. There's one Adolf good. Adolf Rub. He was the coach of Kentucky. Hey, can you give me that oh, bandana uh, and throw it at Chris's face? Yeah, well, that wasn't a joke. Yeah. There you go. That was, that was a real person. He was Adolf just naming Act. a fact. Literally, it was Adolf Rowe. I know, but I just want him to have it. Uh, <laughs> it's preemptively. It's preemptively. Yeah, like, when I shaved my head, it was, was going to look like Tom Papa someday. So I shaved him. He looks like the town crier. He was one of the major organizers of the Holocaust. Yeah. Whoa. Wow. Wow. That's not easy planning. So, Original realist, yeah. dude. Good yeah. PR job, right? <laughs> So they so a lot of the Nazis went to Argentina. After Not a lot, but but they said that they went to Brazil and Argentina is when they escaped, and then they were saying, "Oh, fucking Argentinians!" But Argentina didn't do anything. You know, the Allies also they got some Nazis and well, they put them around the world because they let it happen. A, yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Be the thing is, they had a lot of advantages taking those guys. <laughs> uh, what's a hat, Van? I'm sorry, I yeah. never heard a fucking history sorry, about Argentina. Big jokes. <laughs> yeah, big that's what this jokes. show is. It's not my show. It's not about Dick hey, Lewis. Lewis. Joke. Fuck you. Hold on, time out. Lewis pussy is, jokes, too. Lewis Lewis is is pussy great. jokes. If we, are picking, if we are picking a fucking thing, is it about Argentinian history or is it about dick jokes? It's much more about dick jokes. I say fat jokes. Nazi dick. <laughs> I yeah. Nazi <laughs> dick fat jokes about her fucking about huge vag. Yeah. yeah. Her vag that could stop any war. <laughs> Just Everyone starts puking. puking. But, but how do you find a Nazi? Because you don't, I mean, how do you find a Jew in, in South? But you don't look Jewish. Like here, you can spot a well, that's, Jew. Well, that's what I'm saying is that you think that Jews look a certain right, thing. Right, you know right. I mean, a certain way. Big but nose, no. horns. But then but you look. Neither one of us looks Jewish. You look Jewish. Yeah, Come you on. look Jewish. No. Oh yeah, the star oh. David with the fucking fist wow. in the middle of it. Well, yeah. you look more than me, but uh, he doesn't look yeah. Jewish. You look like a guy who beat up Jared Fogle. Yeah, on the yard. <laughs> See, <laughs> and you—he looks more ISIS than Jewish. Like, oh, exactly. Yeah. Well, that—that's no. all my comedy about. No, about he, look, looking terrorist. he looks like he—he yeah. he looks like he killed that girl on Aruba. <laughs> which which girl? You're ah, in the he just made a Vandersloot joke a couple minutes Vandersloot, ago. Yeah, yeah, I'm fucking adding to it. Mm -hmm. It's all this Dutch <laughs> shit. With the, we're European this week, bitch. You're European. You're you're European. Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> if we're back. So in Argentina, is the comedy like 20 years behind, like it is in you know, like your Europe? jeans? <laughs> well, look, look, who's there? Nazi, Nazi, come in. You're right. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Take my wife, please. <laughs> <laughs> Why am I still wearing this hat? You fucking assholes. Why did the chicken cross the road? <laughs> Why did <laughs> to hide from the Nazis? <laughs> Hey, <laughs> hey, have you uh, have you guys seen the emeralds? <laughs> <laughs> Women be shopping for donkeys. Ah <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit! Uh, you ever notice how white people be doing the waltz? <laughs> Black people, they don't live here. <laughs> oh shit! Best country ever. Yes. <laughs> don't come. <laughs> Yeah, long hours. <laughs> so, <laughs> we're gonna be shopping for fucking donkeys. Pretty proud of that one. I'm not gonna lie. Oh God! Does anybody have a spare flip flop? <laughs>
<laughs> Cut your hands off. <laughs> goes from comedy to just begging on stage. <laughs> please, anyone have please. square meal. I have three children. <laughs> I need to feed my babies. Please, please. <laughs> Please, oh. throw pennies at me. <laughs> <laughs> Every show ends with them just throwing coins at me. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, so oh, gracious. Please. Thank you. Oh. I will sell you pelt. That's his merch, pelts. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be selling squirrel <laughs> pelts outside. I will be outside selling <laughs> Anaconda skin pocketbook. Instead of selling this album. <laughs> 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 Anybody want crocodile necklace? <laughs> I own one book. You want? <laughs> oh, shit. It, it, oh, I got a it's one. yard sale merch. It's yeah. <laughs> sweating here. Think about it. <laughs> so use the racist bandana white man. <laughs> How much for the monkey paw? <laughs> Pretty much is all of that in a nutshell. <laughs> Uh, the crocodile and uh, uh, the donkey uh, <laughs> and all that shit. <laughs> it is funny, though, because, like, all right, look, I just had a bunch of stickers made. I had a bunch of magnets. That he has a ton of merch. Uh, Lewis, for his show, I mean, I mean, it is. We are so fucking fortunate up here and so oversaturated oh, yeah. with the ability to have uh, fans. Even if you're a nobody, you can create some type of fandom. You know, <laughs> I'm not talking about you, Doug. <laughs> um, but... Down there, I mean, you're just you know, all you're doing is fucking no, stand up. Now, uh, no, no, I mean, no. if you guys no, get no. stickers, left, would take fucking left, a, yes. eight months. When right? I left, yes, but now uh, you you have TV shows with stand up comedy. Yeah. you have uh, YouTube following. Uh, I don't know, seven hundred thousand people. Or yeah, but the people comedians. don't have money to spend on merch. Is what he's saying. Uh, are you crazy? Uh, uh, no, no. Now, now, jokes aside, when like in the rich? U.S., you think yeah. that uh, I say I am from South America, and you're Mexican. No, I'm more South. South Mexican. No one gives a shit about anything that is in the South. But this is a lot of well, money. Mexico is in South America. Central this America. Is, it's Central America. So, but you don't know anything from. I do. Like if I. Okay, what do you know about South America? Chile. <laughs> what? Okay. Not what, the what fucking meal. Okay, we will go for that. Chile. What, what is the capital of <laughs> Chile? Chile? What's What's ca capital of Chile? Go. Uh, go for it. It's easy. Santiago. My point. Santiago. There you go. Yeah. There you go, Scopo. Hold on. <laughs> Ask him again. Ask him again. Hey, I want everyone to know I did not Google that. <laughs> Bobby's like, you have to say Santiago. What's the capital <laughs> to put on Cyrus? Scopo's like, Adolf hey. Eichmann. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Yeah, no, you're right. I mean, Americans don't know I mean, anything about any other uh, other culture or That's country. True. But yeah, I, I I assume that every country in South America is dirt poor. Yes. No, it's, it's, it's a lot not of, like that at all. But, but, it's, it's but really, there's a, lot of rich, there's a lot of rich people. Well, but, what happens uh, in South America, though, the, the government is usually a little corrupt. Um, the people usually rebel against the government more so than up here. Okay, if we go to politics, what yeah. I saw in the bailout in 2008... Yeah. Yeah, but I've never seen in any country in the world. Yeah, we of course we're, but we're better at. We it, have stock. Okay, <laughs> we have a lot more money than it's you. True. Okay, <laughs> that is yeah, also we, true. We're not getting, we're not having our politicians hit with spears. Right. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I think the extremes are like, like there are a lot of rich people, but I think when you're poor in South America, you are. Yeah, we've never had an assassin. Yeah, yeah, that yeah. is also true. Like we've poor never... people here, they're poor, but it's like comparatively to fucking somebody. Yeah. Okay, but they're not. Right. Right. But we've never had our president assassinated by a poison dart. Yeah. Okay, but I will tell you this. I don't think I. I, 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 I want to be president. Can anybody do this? <laughs> I will be your friend. Yeah. <laughs> well, okay. no one murdered any presidents in Argentina. What's that? Uh, we don't have any murdered presidents in no, Argentina. No, I know. I was kidding. No, no, no. I mean, I would too. No, I am. I am. I am uh, contrasting and saying you have. You murdered presidents. We have a yeah. Well, we did two. Yeah. One. We, yeah, did two. Two. Yeah. we did two. 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 Yeah. Two. Two. We did two yeah. in one attempt. But you yeah. guys steal oxen and shit, you know? We don't have that. What? Yeah. What? You guys steal livestock and it's steal it's a baby plural. at night. That's the plural of oxen. <laughs> That's lions, you fucking idiot. They don't do that. Yeah, he oh. just, Dude, I, I, I live half of the time here and half in Europe. Yeah. So I yeah. tour in Europe and I do stand up. Now, would here. you go back home to visit your family or do you have to send them I, money? I Are they go rich? Once, I go once a year. To I work. Did you have, there. Does your family have money? Uh, I I never like I was middle class. Middle so class, right? I, uh, so what do you was your house connected to another house to another house? They think be, that before, went up nine nah, stories. No, no, no. Before, do you guys all pay with one comedian, bucket that you guys share? I, I was a lawyer, so I, I used to you work. You were. That's where that Our serious shit comes from, son. <laughs> yeah, That's where that serious shit comes from, son. <laughs> That's why motherfuckers <laughs> uptight with this shit. Even in South America, the Jews are lawyers. The, the thing is, I, I <laughs> Jesus. 
The thing is, I liked it. I liked it. It was good. I know, but I have to go against it. It's my show, just in case they listen. He was against it. What kind of what kind of law did you practice? Corporate. Corporate law. In our This man is angry that one sweater was sold. Um, so what did you have to do? What I was the Mika biggest? Hold on, Aaron. Take. Don't fucking uh, take, don't just yeah, talk yeah, over yeah. your own bomb. Take that bomb. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I do hey. on stage. Hey. <laughs> Nobody realizes. Yeah, we know. You're talking. Know. Yeah. That's why you had to get the muscles to yeah. distract from yeah. a couple of your hot yeah. ones. Beats right. Uh, <laughs> hey, can you do me a favor? And yeah. fix the vein on the side of your head? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Can you fix your microphone? <laughs> Just put it yeah, there. You go. Hey. Did you like that one? Yeah. <laughs> so you practice corporate law? Yeah. yeah. In Argentina, that's yeah. crazy. In fact, I started doing comedy. I was accepted to do an LLM in NYU, and a I what? came to. Who? What did you say? LLM. Let me say it again. LLM. L L M L L M Oh L L M Oh so it's L L M L M L M F O some kind of law degree right L M See Lulu Lemon Thank God I have I'm an immigrant too I'm from Canada I was a Jew The immigrants the Jews He's not an you're from Can you're not an immigrant you're just us Yeah Yeah you're just us dude Canada's us stop acting like it's another country Why not Argentina Dude, that's another country. Yeah. He can get bit by a spider and die. <laughs> what do you? What's gonna happen to you in fucking Toronto? A Nothing. Moose. Someone from Buffalo come up and ruin everything? Yeah. All right, let me take that bandana right off your Thanks, fucking. I, I got that for a fucking bomb rant. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to do a Geraldo and it failed. <laughs> the fuck's gonna? Happen? <laughs> I didn't even get what you were going for. <laughs> I didn't either. Well, yeah, I Geraldo saw... was a lawyer too. Yeah, he was a lawyer. That yeah. is correct. I yeah. hope you end up like him. Yeah. <laughs> I oh, heard that joke before. That, that is that, that. I don't like. What Pass the bandana. I heard mean. that joke before. Well, he's saying you're insulting. In the roast. Yeah. yeah. I heard that joke. You said it before. To, to, no, no, it didn't. Bomb. Hold on. To Jess and Nick. He did that. To Jess and Nick. Oh yeah, yeah. Wrote, Shh, Everyone, shut the fuck up. Wait, wait, stop, stop. I got. A, I got a laugh. So fuck off. I don't get the bandana. <laughs> Where'd you laugh from? Uh, I don't remember Where? the name the name okay. of the comedian, but she told yeah. that joke in a in a roast to Jason Nick, You're saying roast they jokes? say that you are the next Lou, Greg Giraldo. I hope you finish oh. the Lewis same way. Lewis is stealing. Right. Yeah. Lewis is stealing. <laughs> Lewis I, is I the heard act. that and use it on him. First of all, can I say something. <laughs> Thank you. Anyway, Lewis did not steal that joke because he does not watch TV. because yeah. he can't afford to have a TV. <laughs> very true. Thank you yeah. very much. All right. He's like an Argentinian. His wife has a TV. Yeah. yeah. So when well, he it was my TV. That bitch. <laughs> No, I, I only. Take the TV? <laughs> he got the kids. You got the TV. Uh, he, this guy's got nah. a fucking iPad Mini. Yeah. <laughs> I only know that because I love Greg I, yeah, I, I I've seen everything. And uh, hey, can yeah. you not be on me when I bomb? No. Can you, you fucking asshole? No. God, I want to fucking just put my head in your cavernous pussy. Yeah. <laughs> just go, Dad. Like a cork. Dad. <laughs> Do, do, do. <laughs> 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 it's the bat. <laughs> Deepu's in there. You go in, you go in torch first. <laughs> yeah, that's why I lost Deepu. He's in there. <laughs> yeah, what what happened with Lauren Stones that were in her pussy? Did those get passed? Oh, right right there. There. Whoa! Oh, shit. They're huge. They're boulders. Yeah, that was great. Right. That's oh. from her vag, dude. No way. Yeah. yeah. It was like yeah. that when the boulder oh. changed. Check it out. Jones. It wasn't even kidney stones. It was actually a dead. <laughs> Baby, she forgot to get out. It's a, it was a fossilized kid head. <laughs> toilet it, baby. It's an American comedy, baby. Really? Yeah. yeah. But I have another comedy. one in there. So oh, I will have nightmares. With These you. would be yeah. gemstones in Argentina. <laughs> <laughs> I could feed my family <laughs> for 20 years. <laughs> you can sell this shit. <laughs> In this, my we eat these. Ooh. We eat these in my country for eyes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, shit! Yeah. These are like Argentinian carrots. Oh my god! Argentinian, oh. Argentinian <laughs> carrots. <laughs> you don't eat your kidney stones. So yeah. much potassium. Can I see that? <laughs> <laughs> it really looks like a dead twin, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, Lauren, god. do you feel better now that those are gone? It really does look like um, a bullshit. I, it's a dried up miscarriage. Yeah. I do, but. Yeah. Um, um, I have more, so I have to get them. Oh, moved shit. Again. Oh, no. More! I Let me know. see. Jeez, you're like blood diamond over Stop here. Stop <laughs> Fucking mining these some, things some in there. Chileans huh? down there. No. It's okay. <laughs> They'll be out soon. Yeah. So, well, that's, uh, I mean, dude, good for you. I mean, first of all, you had to learn English, correct? Yeah. Well, and you learned English yeah. in Spain. Uh, in Argentina. Oh, you yeah. is it a is it in the well, school? I used to work in English as okay. a lawyer. Oh, you did? So oh, you, okay. you work a lot. 
Yeah, so you got to learn it. Yeah. I used to work in a firm for three with 300 lawyers. Dude, if I so was, uh, if I was on wow. trial and he showed up as my defender, I'd be like, I am fucked right now. I, I, actually, I would think the same. Don't worry. I don't know. I would like it. <laughs> I mean, if you showed up with that facial hair that doesn't connect, I'd be like, I'd be like all right, I'm fucked. I got a fucking Argentinian hipster I'm about to fucking try my case for smuggling heroin to my asshole. Great. But I, I, I know he looks like a respectable dude. He has, you have uh, caring eyes. Yes. Caring eyes. Yeah. Yes. The eyes of the yeah. Jew. I never yeah. heard that before. You have caring eyes and huge eyebrows. Yeah. This is getting a little gay. No. <laughs> <laughs> we yeah. kill gays in our country. You should, you should, <laughs> we put your head on a rock and we hit it with another rock. You should talk to Aaron about fucking trimming your eyebrows up like a fucking she man. Mine, I don't have to trim I them. I know, anymore. it was a joke. Shut Thanks. up. Do they look good? You don't have to trim anymore because they're gone. Yeah. Powder. Look at it, I got burnt <laughs> on my head. <laughs> I love that he went, I don't have to trim them anymore. Yeah. Thank God you're getting married. Yeah. A couple more years out there, you would have been sucking a nice He's been yeah. married before, you're haven't you? Me. No, I was, I was engaged before. Uh -oh. oh, that's oh, really? Right. Oh. Yeah, I have baggage about this. Oh, you know, the it's same a, it's like me, man. I, I got married in my second engagement. Oh, really? Not the first one. Not the you first one. The first one. Yeah. yeah. How did well, how did that not? How did you get engaged? And it. Who, who I was it engaged. Off? Here's my fear about planning this wedding too. So I'm carrying this baggage, which I have to deal with. She's we, gonna find you. I porn. thought we'd just go get married. No, I don't even. I jack off twice a year. No, and that's because it was a bunch of gay so guys yeah. sucking <laughs> each other. The steroids. Up. He in can't a come room, yeah. Just lifting weights. <laughs> I got engaged the last time. Then we kept trying to plan a wedding, but then the families kept getting involved, and then it was too much of a fucking thing, and that turned me off of it so much so you backed like, out yeah wow the first marriage you left yeah well i wasn't married we were engaged i mean garage you yeah. walked away and yeah. how do you fuck i mean that once that truck starts going down the hill right how the fuck do you put the brakes on that and walk away it was like well i was gonna <laughs> move here anyways and then she didn't want to move so it kind of worked out easier Not where is she that. canada in toronto i set her up in a place when i Moved. I'm set her up in an apartment. And I left. What, like and a fucking it. what? Like a mob guy? I guess. I mean, and you, you, she so met you, a new dude and she's married so, now. She's happy. Well, really? Oh yeah. Well, so you work. left this girl. You gave her an apartment. You paid for it. Yeah. Did you buy it? No. I was, what, like, did you, paid did a she start few dating a Jamaican guy after you told me? No, it was a joke that I did. Oh, it was uh, a joke. Okay. Uh, I pictured her dating a Jamaican okay. guy. Yeah. Really? I picture that too. Yeah. So she got married to a guy like you, or no, oh, like a, a more redneck guy. Me. Can I give him a bomb banana for yeah. doing a uh, fake laugh? For me? Yeah. yeah. Did I laugh? Yeah, you went. <laughs> oh, at the Jamaican dude thing. Yeah, yeah. I, I thought that was all right. I, l I laughed him. That was funny. Yeah, why am I listening? Yeah. Stop <laughs> announcing shit. No, 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 no. I'm Stop fucking. Yeah, you stick. No, you didn't the bomb banana. No, no, it was weird. It was weird what you just did. You went ha ha, and you looked right back at your fucking head. What are you, my fucking foster father that used to hit me? <laughs> I'm kidding. He never hit me with my. I never got hit by my foster father. It was he my just, stepdad. He just fucked you. <laughs> um, yeah. So, so, uh, yeah, so she, yeah, she married like a rednecky dude. She came from a small town, moved to Toronto, and then she married. Is he a good-looking like guy? Friend. He's okay. I yeah. mean, scrawny, kind of hipster. Good job. What? Good job. Some blue-collar shit. I don't. Do know. they still live know. in the same apartment you hooked? You set her no, up? No, no. Good. They, they moved. They got a backyard somewhere. I think they moved to. A you know, he fucks her right. talking anti-Semitic. Probably. Uh, I would. Yeah. yeah I guess we wow. all. Would. The genius in here. Huh? Yeah. You, you were engaged before. Yeah. And how did you call it off? I mean, did you have to? It was more or less. How do you unkill a sheep? She was eaten by a leopard. Uh, <laughs> I kill her. Uh, no, I mean. How did um, you get your diary back? <laughs> it was she it was a long drought. relationship. Yeah, and so how, how at the moment, uh, five five years. Five years, and then now she's Argentinian, right? Or she's, yeah, uh, yeah. So it was in Argentina. So when yeah. you, how old was she? Um, Ten. <laughs> <laughs> what? Just the shame. Uh, yes. That's old over there. Uh, we were yeah. in. <laughs> she was used up by nine. Uh, I knew I could not like commit. Like twenty four. Twenty four. Yeah. And yeah, that's too young. That's too young to get married. It, it but is. I guess there it's probably not, right? The, what's the average age that people get married? Ask him. I'm, not, I'm from fucking I'm Boston. I'm Scopo. You're fucking Look staring at, at me. What's the average age in Argentina, Bob? <laughs> Talk to him. He's right there. I'm assuming in, in like other countries. Oh, you're trying to stay on camera. I get way you. younger. Uh, yeah, I, I, they get married probably like 20 or 21 because well, they believe this, in God and shit. But this country used to be 18, 19. Yeah. You were married having kids. As a no, woman, not, not that, but maybe 22, 23. That's fucking crazy. That's young. That's really uh, crazy. To be with yeah. one person for the rest of your life at 23. The girl I was dating yeah. when I was 23, I mean, holy shit. If I was with her today, I'd fucking kill How myself. How a lot of people get divorced now. When I was dating, yeah. a lesbian now. 
Mm. Yeah. It, 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 that's what Facebook is amazing for. When yeah. you go back and you, yeah. all of a sudden you see some post of a girl, you're like, oh my God, that's what's her name when we were in fucking junior high yeah. and I loved her. And then you go through her Facebook and you yeah. see her now and you're like, what the but fuck we, did we, the sun touch your yeah. face? Me and Dave right. Smith double teamed a chick who's yeah. got like two kids now. Yeah. And it's just so uncomfortable, like looking at her with her family. I, I I looked at her husband's eyes, like in the pictures. And I'm like, dude, you don't know what me and Dave Smith did to your uh, fucking how about, wife. How about this? How about this? When you fucking see a chick you used to fuck, and now her daughter's like 19. Oh and yeah. And you're like, ooh, I could go double that's dipping. Hot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Let's go over there. Yeah. That's hot. That's I wonder like... if that's ever happened to her. Oh yeah. yeah. That's Jerry Springer shit. He's like all wait, the time. Well, yeah, but I'm talking about. I mean, those fucking weird people on that show. Are probably they fucked each other's cousins. I'm talking like you know, a, a comic or you know someone like that, like a smoking hot chick back in the day. You fucked her, and then later in life you're doing a show and you fucking you hook up with the chick, you're making out with you, you fuck her, and it's yeah. My mom told me about you. She was a big Ooh, fan. And yeah. Ooh, Abby, that's hot. Oh, was that hot? Yeah. Was that hot? yeah. I had that with Judy Gold. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? I never saw you. I t I t I'm a lesbian. <laughs> fuck Trump. I Tinder matched with uh, my the girl I lost my virginity to's little sister, who's like yeah. eight years younger than her. Yeah. So she was a child when I lost my virginity to this girl, like literally a little seven year old fat girl. And then I Tinder matched with her, and we want to fuck now, but we just haven't been able to like match up. And yeah. Look it up. So you're gonna fuck the chick you first fucked? No, no, no. no her little sister. Her sister. sister. Yeah. So you get She's both hot. of them. Yeah. Her yeah, sister both of them. was a child. Is that hot? Oh, is yeah. That, is you that, get like, her back I, I always, in the prime again. That's when I wonder, like, if I'm going to go to heaven some, when I die, and I know you're going to make a fat joke next week, I get it. But, I mean, when you do die, like, you think about, like, okay, are you going to be presented with all this shit that you did That'd in your life? That'd be a great life? video. Like, oh, shit, I forgot about that fat chick. You know? <laughs> you know, what was that movie where you watched, like, the videos? Uh, oh, yeah. When you went to De heaven. Defending you were, your life. Yeah, that's, yeah. Great that's movie. a great movie. It's a great movie. Brooks. But imagine if we have to fucking do that. Mm -hmm. Where you're going to see all Oh, the, my God, dude. Uh, imagine if they, like, can see inside your head what you jerk off to. Well, first of all, the What makes you yeah. come? Is God going to consider that the standard of rape is way different than it was when I started fucking? <laughs> like, if you just fuck a drunk chick now, now apparently you rape <laughs> but that's how I got laid throughout all of my early 20s. I think you just got to rip your uh, face uh, on tape. God, you to maybe I love that he, he, that out. I love that he, he started <laughs> laughing and then he just backed off of it. Yeah. <laughs> we were all like, he was like <laughs> <laughs> you know, like you yeah. creep into someone's window and you fuck them <laughs> like you did in the 90s, uh, right? Adrian, you got your next case yeah. right here. Uh, yes. <laughs> you hold a gun in their mouth. But you no, say, I'm true. taking what's mine. Yeah, you're, dude. you're supposed to, if a girl is that's right. I couldn't afford gloves, so I wore socks over my hands. That is true, though. If you fuck a girl after two beers or something, it's considered legally rape or something. Is it legally Come rape on. now? Something like that. Something. No. Oh, never mind. I was kidding about everything I just said. I mean, I, Norman's can the you most go that? active on the fuck scene nowadays. And right? you fuck, fuck drunk it. chicks all the time, but you're drunk too. Yeah. I'm drunk too. You're raping yeah. each other. Rape, yeah. rape. Who cares? Yeah. Two well, rapes cancel each other out. Let me out. ask you a question, though. What? If you're drunk and she's drunk, really, is that is, does that play into the... You oh, rape each other. Totally. That there, there's something that, that is important there that is consensual. What'd you say? If, if she agrees, it's okay. If she doesn't agree, it's yeah, not but okay. Yeah, but the idea if is... you cannot decide to agree, it's not no, no, okay. No, no, but the whole idea, the idea is if you're intoxicated at all, you're not within the actual right mindset to agree. Yeah, sounds so right. even if she agrees, the idea is, oh, you're still raping her. There's like there's campaigns where they say if you're both drunk, the guy is still the, uh, the really? perpetrator. Oh, because yeah. you're penetrating her. Wow. Oh, well... That's pretty fun. Uh, wow. Norman, what are you going to do? Get do you get worried about this shit, like when you're on the road? Not at all. Really? See, I'm not like a, a threatening-looking guy. Yeah. Like, if I looked like you, I yeah. think I'd be more worried. Are you kidding? You f you scare me way worse than him. I'm talking about You're that chicks. fucking the guy who sneaks in a window at a college. <laughs> 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 runs down the street from Charles Bronson naked. <laughs> yeah, you have that fucking beady little fucking, you, like, Sherlock Holmes <laughs> knows you did it right at the beginning of the fucking show <laughs> but there's nothing like rapey about the idea of beer goggles that was just a thing yeah. you know what i'm saying like it was a joke you can go to spencer's yeah. gifts and buy beer goggles you know like and now it's like a thing. Spencer's gifts. Beer goggles. When are you, when were you born? Fucking 1965? Spencer's Gifts is still around today. You guys yeah, ever get wax lips? <laughs> <laughs> I got my Ramon shirt last oh, week. I had a whoopy cushion. Dude, I got anarchy fucking wrist bracelets. Bugging yeah. the ice cube. 
<laughs> hey, you want a piece of gum? <laughs> <laughs> Blow the candle comes back on. Blow the candle comes back on. <laughs> what about that Kurt Cobain? My bow tie spins. <laughs> <laughs> woo, 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 woo. <laughs> You're an idiot. Uh, I'm so, over 50 and feeling nifty. Hey, uh, <laughs> it says uh, a lot of colleges have it in their like in their, their handbook that. Yeah. Uh, a policy that sexual activity with intoxicated person is, by definition, sexual assault. Wow. 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 Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Well, hold on. While the practical and legal aspects of this are important. Oh, okay. Well, well he gave blah, up on blah, a word. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he, saw a word <laughs> he saw a word coming up, and he was like, Never mind. It's all false. The computer said that. The computer's not working. Pours <laughs> water into it. <laughs> so how do you make money here? Like, are you making any dough? No, here, okay. here I I invest money. Are you are you married now? You invest yeah. money. You're yeah. married. What does yeah. your wife do? Uh, my wife is a choreographer and dancer. Ooh, so she's yeah. in the arts. Dancer. In fact, the thing is, we have a theater and dance company together. I write theater and I direct theater too. Right. Wow. Okay. So with that, we make money in Europe. Yeah. You make that in Europe. Yeah. Right. Now, it's easier to make a living in Europe than it is here, correct? In New York City. Well, yeah, because we have something there that you don't like here, that is socialism. So, uh, huh. for example, if you're an artist, I, I have a flat there, and they help me because we are artists and we have certain amount in the in our incomes. Mm -hmm. Right. So they help you to, to get something. They have that in New oh. York City. Yeah, we well. have, it's yeah. have artist housing. It's called yeah. the free yeah. market, yeah. motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, but it's also, it's very hard to get that. Yeah, very hard. The, the, yes. the, 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 I mean, the, the uh, actors, buildings. And you no, have there's a lot. By the way, there's yeah. more than you think. I just went through this. Try, I got into a fucking one of these um, like artist Artists. community housing. Yeah. And I just, it was too far away from my son's place. So I, I opted not to do it, oh. well, but it's there, not that hard. There's yeah. a there's a lot. If you actually put the time in to find like artist housing or any type of like there's a lot on the shit, west side. Hang on one there's second. There's a ton. Yeah, yeah. First of all, don't ever correct. I'm gonna put my hat back on, so you know who the captain is. Okay. Don't ever correct me on my show. <laughs> <laughs> Let me just say this. It's not that hard here to get. Uh, no, <laughs> not as hard as it used to be. <laughs> but, um, <laughs> it's uh. <laughs> There's, the, um, <laughs> there's, uh, yeah. yeah, but that, so that's cool. Yeah. But, so you're, you're, yeah, you're but the, yeah. the difference you're between there is they we, make the people through taxes we, pay for it. That's socialism. Where here is people have to choose to opt in, which I think is a better yeah. system. And what that's you, why what Lewis, you, I don't think he's that dumb. There people say he's dumb. He's not. He's just has too much energy. He's, he's no, very the thing smart, is, he's just not talented. The thing is, <laughs> <laughs> the only difference is uh, are the extremes. No, he nailed it. You know, they're... <laughs> Like, what I've done with no talent is pretty impressive. That's yeah, very true. Yeah, it's very hustle. true. Yeah, you really are hustle. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're Danny Ainge, man. Um, what you don't have there is poor people, Detroit poor. Aha. Uh -huh. You know what? that you don't have Detroit poor. Detroit, Detroit in Europe, yeah. blacks. Yeah, blacks. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> poor. No, sound I just said poor. That's on you. That's Whoa. also that's also very true. There's no blacks. No, no not in any country. <laughs> but for example, in Belgium, you don't have. Like that kind of poor. Oh, yeah. Right? yeah. Uh, you don't have, like you, we were saying in some countries in, in South America, they are very poor. Detroit, very poor. In socialist countries, much more level. Where, where, yeah. Now, your, your wife is here with you now or is she no, there? Normally, they travel with me. I have a 19th month old daughter. You have a baby, dude? Oh. And they're not here right now? No, it's kind of. Uh, I yeah, mean, I don't want to see it. Here's some well, random uh, porn. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't show the I picture. Have, I don't have time for that. You're no, still like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, so they are working. <laughs> she's working in Norway now. We travel with lots. the baby. Can yeah. we see a picture of your wife? Oh, yeah. Jesus All right. Christ. Yeah. Yeah. Let, me see. Let me see it. Uh, <laughs> so, <laughs> hey, buddy. His passcode was so, Nazi. Uh, is, can I ask you a question? Yeah. How hard is it to not be around your brand new baby for, now for this long? Now it's very shitty. It's, yeah. it's hard, it is, right? Especially it pursuing this career that's not going to happen. The first six months where they just lie there and do nothing? <laughs> <laughs> I, that that, that, is, that is in my head all the time. Like, why the fuck are you in New York right now? Your wife now? said, you too. Your, your, your kid's going to have his first steps. You're trying to write a fucking, you know, <laughs> You should new leave the fuck out. You're translating a joke about the okay, river. Okay, this is my daughter. Uh, 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 my, let me see. Uh, oh, is that your wife? What's on, what's on your phone? Is a little oh, semen. Uh, that is semen. Yeah. Was, I come uh, on my phone every day. I, I have to. I have <laughs> to. It's very nice. Now, the blood of my ancestors. <laughs> I have to give pleasure. Now these fruits. <laughs> do you sell these <laughs> for money? You want to buy a baby and ten limes? <laughs> <laughs> 
Do you? <laughs> Ted Lyme. You, you put your kid to work early. Yeah. <laughs> What's he, on the corner of fucking Van Nuys? My baby's 11 months and a migrant worker. <laughs> I hope someone's drinking. She Corona. works so hard. Did the good, the beautiful, be beautiful kid, brother. Thank really you very much. Beautiful. Let's but, see the wife, the yeah, Norwegian yeah, you dancer. Me about, uh, Jesus. Yeah. Don't sh if you don't want to, you don't have yeah, to. You, don't have to. you can just yeah, show me. Norman just needs yeah, shit to do. Norman's just too. fucking weird. Yeah, I'm weird. I'm weird. Very I'm weird. I like women. Very oh, lovely. my God. Let You're beautiful. Yeah. And she is definitely white. Let me yeah. see. Yeah. Thank God, right? Yeah. Like, give me. <laughs> I was like, give me, give me. Dude, why? You, you ever see an Argentinian woman? Were you crazy? Beautiful. No, she's Norwegian. I know she's Norwegian. But bad shit crazy, right? not as good as I thought That Spanish kind of crazy. Listen, man. She's beautiful. And here's the thing. tough. Our, Thank you very much. Spanish, man. yeah, Spanish women are fucking nuts. Yeah, bananas. Yeah, but but I kind of <laughs> like it. There's something about that jealousy and the fucking alpha male. They have a real alpha male yeah. thing, and yeah. but they're very feminine. And when they when they're your chick, they're your chick. And then when you fuck, they fucking want to be yeah. fucked. But if you step over that line, and they'll fight you. But I, I you, like yeah. like Sofia Vergara type. That kind of fucking. Can you not? Can you ask to talk? <laughs> No, I'm kidding. I, <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm joking. Who? Can I talk? Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it, uh, it is hard to be on the road without them. Yeah, so, it's fucking... Um, I, dude, I can't be away for more than four <laughs> days. And I, I Four yeah. days now, and I'm like, I got to go. I got to go. Well, the thing is, we had this rule that I could be four or five weeks alone. My rule. Yeah. I don't want... But now with the baby, it's too much. It's too really much, too man. Much. Yeah, you can't. I yeah, Skype every day. Now. And she's like, pop, pop, pop. Like, she understands now. Yeah. Especially Wait, now because at the, the, that age right yeah. there, because I got a three-year-old, every month it's a new milestone. Yeah. So it's like, you'll literally, you see your kid, it's like it's like a different fucking kid. They look different. Yeah. They're uh, doing different well, things. Well, 19th crazy. month, not so much. But she changes. I mean, I yeah. agree. Yeah. Wait, wait until your kid is like... You gotta go to work. Like oh, Max is like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm oh, like, dude. I gotta go to work, and he's like, yeah. Can I come with you? Yeah. And I'm yeah. like, No, you fucking yeah. don't. But yeah. get the fuck back in. You no, I'm get off. <laughs> <laughs> no, but what? the thing is, my, uh, I, I I couldn't do this without my wife. Yeah, and she's very supportive. I know. Otherwise, have, your baby would just be walking the streets thinking, alone. I, uh, <laughs> <laughs> without my wife, my baby <laughs> not have to sell limes. I don't know. Selling <laughs> limes. No, that day I'm seeking the head like any comedian, yes. and I doubt all the time. Yeah. And my wife, like, no, go, go for it. And yeah, go yeah. and go. Good. And, yeah, and things great. are happening. But what a poor wife. She's like, she married a lawyer, and then oh, I no, 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 she didn't marry a lawyer. Oh, okay. She married a lawyer. You were like she, she married a lawyer. Like we, when we met, I was still working as a lawyer because we met in Argentina dancing tango. But then uh, at some moment I stopped. I, I, I started working as a lawyer, but in, not in a big firm. Do you have to go to school for eight years to be a lawyer in Argentina? Six. Six. Uh -huh. Six, and I did a master's in law and economics. So that's uh, yeah, So here's the thing, though. You, 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 if you wanted to, right now, how old are you? 32. You're 32. Yeah. So right now, you have, you guys are both pushing your dreams. You're yeah. both pushing yourself. Yeah. But in reality, you could go get a fucking job. True. You could go back to Argentina. You could, in, in Spain, wh wherever you are, and be a lawyer. You could get I a great go job. go for the bar. and uh, You could, again, yeah. yeah. It wouldn't yeah. be a fucking that yeah. hard for you. You could go get a fucking great job, yeah. get a great place. So you have a fucking amazing B plan. If necessary. The thing so is, why not fucking go for it? Why not? I, I think if you're a stand-up, mm -hmm. if you can do anything else yes. but stand-up, you should do it because this is fucking hard. Yeah. But the thing is, this is my life. I write all the time. I perform all the time. I love what I'm doing. Yeah. I wouldn't like to go back to that. You don't want to go back to a no. job. Well, there you go. That's good. Yeah. I, mean, I, I like to be on the road. I like to... Hang with you guys. Yeah, I, I've been like here for four years. I know, now. but look at Aaron Berg. You don't want to be that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do you want to? Do you want to put everything into your body like yeah. carrot top? <laughs> <laughs> By the way, he's in New York right now. Yeah. Uh, he's right here without yeah. the wig. You didn't know that. <laughs> his face looks fucked up. Oh, yeah. so bad. Yeah. I don't listen. You know what? With his face, here's the thing. With his face, he's from Vegas. He's an entertainer, and he his fucking thing is crazy. So fuck it. Who cares? You want to have purple fucking hair and weird lips and wear makeup? Who gives a shit? It, we're not. He, we're not. We're in the. We're in comedy. We're in showbiz. I know, but he looks this, like a ghoul. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah, I think he looks all right. He looks like a tranny now. He looks like he's. 
transferring over he to does. Wimbledon. Yeah. yeah, he might be actually. I, 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 first of all, I think you're getting weird shots. You know, you're getting some weird shots. Of him. It's every shot, he, Bob. He, yeah. he, I, <laughs> I mean, we're looking at a hundred shots. I mean, Michelle Wolf looks good. Michelle Wolf in a tank top. Fucking Michelle Wolf and Karen Top. Oh my god. Tell us about Michelle Wolf. Holy fuck, dude. Has anybody ever made that connection before? Oh my god. I didn't know that Carrot Top and Dan Soda had a web series together. <laughs> check out used people on cc.com. Yeah, check out used people with Carrot Top and yeah. Dan. I don't know. Oh, that's going to come back to me, but it was that worth photo it. That right there. Ah, fuck it. Wow. Holy Jesus. That's great. Well, all right, listen to me. <clears throat> I think that, you know, I think what you're doing is great, but it's... Man, I it's, mean, it's a risk. It's a gamble. Being around, being away from my kid. Your kid would be the hardest Here, thing. Here's the thing, too, is like, we, with your kid, and and believe it or not, Lewis is a great fucking tremendous. Dad. And because, and I think it's because of, and I have the same thing. We have the responsibility to try ten times harder than any other dad because we had fucking shitty childhoods. We didn't, yeah. You didn't have your dad. I. I well, I, what's funny is it goes both ways. Like, there's a lot of people have shitty childhoods and then they project that onto their kids. Like, my mom was right. raped and beaten as a kid. And she, sorry about that. She fucking... <laughs> she, she deserved it. Um, <laughs> she had it coming. But I she... Uh, no, but I mean, she could... really was very abusive toward us and in her mind, it was like, oh, well, it's not as bad as I had it. Yeah. I am the complete opposite. Like, I've never even smacked my kid on the hands. I, I yeah. mean, we're... We practice peaceful parenting. We are really in tune with. Let me ask you this though: be not raising me. a little piece of shit. Let me ask you this though: what? has there been times where you just wanted to fucking whack him in the back of the head with a no. shovel? Good for you. People, people, this is the He's argument. Never... People do this argument all the time. They go like, "Well, what, what do you do if your kid runs in the street? You know, and you want to show him that it's not safe." My instinct isn't to hit my kid if he almost gets hit by a car. Yeah. That's crazy to me. No, 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 no. I'm saying I'm not saying I, I don't hit my kid either. I don't. I don't. Even, I, we don't even. We try not to yell at him. Bobby bites him. We we try not to do anything to him at all. Um, like even how old I, is no, we don't yell because I don't want to. I don't want to put fear into him. I yelled at him one time because he was going to die. Like he was about to do something that would have he could have got hurt. You were about so, to sit on him. And I <laughs> move to Argentina. No! <laughs> Look out below! No! Timber! <laughs> Mac, get out of the way! Daddy, please no! His knee's already bent. He's fucked. <laughs> oh my god. That one made me hot. Uh, so much fun! <laughs> Is he? I got a, fucking, a different accent now. <laughs> so much fun! I, I um, I, I, you know, he's gonna do so. I was like, I'm I went for my own voice. I, 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 I went. Uh, I gotta let you guys play this one out. Yeah. That was fucking really good, you cocksucker. And you did it in such a good acting. You went because you were gonna sit. You were concerned. <laughs> yeah, she had deep concern for Max. UCB one. Um. So yeah, he, I so I screamed. I was like Max, and he got scared at me screaming. Oh wow. And I was like fuck. I don't want him. You know what I mean? You don't want to give your kid fear. But you don't be no pussy either. Well, it's not that a pussy. I don't. I'd rather my kid be a pussy than be a fucking psycho who wants to fight everybody. Yeah. Really? Yeah, like 100%. you? Yeah. Really? I don't want. I think there's uh, a balance. Well, that's that's, a, with, that's a big responsibility. In the that my, my kid was well, in the kindergarten, something like that, and I was with my wife. Nope. Not, so, not a 19 month old. Yeah, in in yeah. Uh, Europe. Would you start kindergarten at nineteen. No, no, months? not kindergarten. Number one line is playground. Preschool. Yeah, something like. My kids in school right now. He's we been in we try to year. take her two or three we have money. to this place <laughs> to play with kids. Yeah, we don't just have to take them to a park. Well, you are Jim. Pigeon, yeah. tree, <laughs> bench. <laughs> no, no, it's a, acorn. <laughs> Mommy who loves them. No, it's a it's a library. <laughs> It's a library <laughs> where people take kids to play together. Uh, no, I have my kids in the school too. Okay. Yeah, I have money too. So, <laughs> yeah. but your kid yeah. was in the school at 19 months. Uh, yeah, he was. Uh, really? Yeah. Yeah. It's it's daycare, you fat <laughs> fuck. Uh, don't get, hey, don't it's not get, Hey, don't get mad at you're, me because your kid's uh, dumb. No, don't get mad at me because <laughs> you're having other people raise your kid. Oh. <laughs> I had better motherfuckers, bitch. Free K for everybody. No, but the thing is, this kid starts hitting my daughter in oh. the face. Oh my yeah. god! Dude. I would literally was he going, was he going like this? So, Real ass dude. <laughs> <laughs> Legion of Skanks. But the thing Co-mites is, unite. <laughs> but the thing is, you discover things because I thought, oh, I will beat this 
little two year old fucking fuck. Yeah. Well, I would I would say something to the parents. Yeah. I would threaten the father right but there. But the thing I didn't. My wife wanted to stop him, and I said, "No, I want to see what she does." What she do? Your daughter. Yeah, oh, yeah, the dog? yeah. Okay. So he was. You just want your daughter to beat them? No way. Yeah, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know many? Do you know many awful jokes? Just ran through all of them. We just like. Go ahead. It gets like better. It hands. gets better because she doesn't understand violence. Yeah, so oh, the, the she kid will. Is like, and she's yeah, yeah. She's like yeah. Go ahead. She got tired. She grabbed the fucking kid from the T-shirt. Yeah. It's in this place where you saw a picture yeah, yeah. with this little plastic ball. Yeah, yeah. Don't touch she my put, limes. She, she put the kid <laughs> in the floor. Yeah. She. She's she stopped him. Yeah. She's oh, stepping the kid, and she went off and said, "Oh, great! If this kid is fucking rapist, you will be okay." So you know? she's like, more Argentinian than. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> she's yeah. not. <laughs> it's like cockfighting. We yeah, will be yeah, okay, yeah. Pete. And then I put on YouTube. I didn't have to do anything. She defend herself. Fine. You come back home. She's smoking, and doing pull-ups. Yeah. You know? <laughs> <laughs> well, Tattoos. she speaks four languages now. What? The yeah, because kid? my wife talks to her in Norwegian. I talk to her in Spanish. Then I have family here that speaks in English to her. Yeah. And her nanny in Norway, for some reason, is uh, French. Oh so she God. goes like au revoir, and she goes yeah. bye bye, and then wow. she speaks a lot of Spanish and Norwegian. So, I mean, we yeah. are so wow. fucking behind the we curve. We really are. Yeah. And yet they all love us. We have the entertainment cornered. We yeah. have and yeah. the fashion and the fashion. That's yeah, no, 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 Europe has the fashion. Uh, Europe has Mil Milan, that, crazy. They have, yeah, but they have, well, okay, they have fashion that They're we can't, we don't wear. No, no, that's not true. We, dude. Look, at, no, that fucking shirt was never in Milan. <laughs> that's not fashionable. <laughs> that, yeah. Yeah, but it is here. He looks like a fucking more guys, lesbian. More guys, <laughs> more guys and lesbians wear that shirt. <laughs> He's dressed like Courtney Love. Fuck off. I'm gonna tell you right How now. How many more you want to go? Here you go. No double bandana. It. There we go. There we go. All right. Drop one there. Hey, listen. No, I think uh, my, my, my kid, something happened with my kid where, uh, oh, let me try to think. But the, the, I told, my wife was like, I didn't do anything because the little kid was doing something to Max. Oh, he was calling Max uh, Poo Poo Head. Mm -hmm. And Dawn was like, I don't want that because she doesn't want Max to do it. Now, your kid, my kid will go and go poo poo head. And now I have to unteach my kid that. And she was like, I didn't say anything. I go, You should have walked up and said to the little girl or the little, whoever the fuck it was, Hey, we don't call, his name is Max, and we don't call, we don't use poo poo head. Poo poo head's bad. And it's okay to teach that little kid in a very gentle way. Yeah. You don't have to go to the fucking. And if the parent walked over and said, What are you doing? Oh, he was saying poo poo head. And I don't, I don't, you know, I wanted him to know his name is Max and not. What are they going to do? Go, hey, you don't teach my kid how not to be a fucking douche? Well, some people are. I like picture that. And if they do do that, that yeah. if they do do that, you go, okay, then keep your little fucking kid away yeah. from me. Yeah. Poo poo head. Well, that's what happened at the park. Some little <laughs> yeah. kid started pushing James into the corner. Right? Oh, wow. Kept on pushing him, kept on pushing him. And Be I was in there. Beatrice lost her shit. Like, on yeah. the dad, she was like, she was like, yeah, your kid's actually bullying my kid. And all that what comes from. What did the dude from, do? Uh, he what was on a cell phone, just being a like, just being a, a completely ignorant. Selling drugs. Can I tell you something. My kid, Selling my drugs. kid goes to swim camp twice yeah. a week. Um, it's it's again, it costs money. But we. Um, <laughs> my kids in swim classes as well. Yeah, oh, dick! Yeah, Beth of the town. Yeah, but East it's River. at a Holiday Inn Express on Forty Third you know, Street. You know, <laughs> <laughs> you know, I make pretty good money, right, Bob? Buddy, relax. <laughs> I said. Can you stop with your resume every time somebody attacks you? Dude, I fuck. We, all right, you make okay money. Okay, well, you keep on making the same joke about me not making money. I, I do pretty good, actually. All right, good. Good for you. Okay. How much money do you make? I don't need to announce it. You want me to tell you off air? I, I think no, you'd be pretty impressed. Tell me right now. I think you'd be pretty impressed. All right, text it to me. I More will. than 100K. I'll be, I'll Lewis be has no. a line of okay. merch. He's it's got not the podcast. 100? He's 100 got yet. the shows. So 100K? This year, I'm doing good. If you, what are you doing? I, like, I have made school teacher. I have oh. made ninety k before, and uh, no, I mean I'm doing. Can okay. I go back to my point? Yes, go ahead. The, the, before we had a fucking deal with your self esteem falling apart. <laughs> well, you keep on making the same fucking joke about me not making money, motherfucker. Well, what are you gonna do? You keep fucking. <laughs> it's a fucking joke. It's a fucking joke. It's a fucking joke. <laughs> it's a fucking joke. Uh, this is literally eight. Oh. Eight's getting mad at each other. Oh. Fucking orange. Why he threw the fruit when there's no daughter to sell it. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh flashlight. All right, all right, the Ball guys, fighting. Uh, Ball guys <laughs> fighting. Ball guys fighting. Ball guys. <laughs> Lewis is hiding. Good, good, good. Put a yeah, Jew yeah. from the Nazis underneath the table. Yeah, Adrian's kids not even have a ton of limes. You can't throw hard things at me, motherfucker. Yeah.
That was Boy, good. you hit the deck quick. Yeah. That was wow. impressive. You got a, you got a fucked up dad. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so. Uh, wow. You learned from the best. That was something. That fucking rag hit me in yeah. the eye, you cunt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. it really caught me in a little snap. Someone gave you, you thought that, that, that orange back. You thought that this Bobby's fight. Bobby's only fruit serving yeah, for the, the whole week. Yeah, the on the rag gave it some weight. You thought that this fight would happen right, in Argentina, but no. Oh, shit. It's in New York. <gasps> what happened? Uh, the fucking, the podcast, we're recording bro. over here, right? You hit that mic hard. That's good, right? Yeah? yeah. Are we still going? Yeah. Okay, good. We're fine. Yeah, this thing... See when you two get angry? You have orange juice on your you fucking right back. Right? Yeah. You broke the orange on me, Bob. Nice. Uh, I, uh, listen. Because you threw shit at my face. You don't throw shit it at me. It was a fucking towel. It does it. It hit me in the eye. Well, close it your eyes. It me. All right? Can my orange back, please? Sorry. Thanks. Are you going to eat it now? No, Why I'm going to... Casey yeah. fucking throws more <laughs> shit. I'm going to defend yeah, myself. Look what I brought you. Um, Wait until oh, I got you, you fucking one try that. Ooh, a but Kentucky oh. Fire Cured. Ooh. You gotta smell it. Open it and smell now, it. Now I, I brought you one too. Fucking not. Like so it. what was my point I was making? Oh. Kids swim about class. The kids. You make huh? more money than Lewis. Yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> no, it was the swim class. <laughs> but he was at the swim class. You were talking about the, the parents on the phone. I'm sitting there. My kid is fucking literally learning to swim in front of me. Going underwater, having a good time. And then I look at these other parents, and they're on their fucking cell yeah. phones. Literally just fucking buried yeah. on their phones. Yeah. Ma, ma, ma. Black kids drowning. Nobody's watching. And I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? Like, this doesn't put a smile on you. I was smiled ear to fucking ear watching Max having a blast in a kicking and going under. And, and these fucking... He likes it? My kid hates it. Loves it. it. He hates it. Dude. Loves it. Max, Max, Max didn't like it. Like the first couple of times, but now we have a pool next door too. We use Dolores's Ooh. pool all the time because you know I don't make that much money, more than you. I think but, uh, <laughs> <laughs> people are so caught up in. It. I think people that take their kids there are just like, oh fuck, someone else is watching our kids yeah. for now. Well, it's a break that's, for a lot of people. That, that's yeah. exactly what it is. People go to the gym and they go, all right, fuck it, dude, watch the kid while I'm doing my own thing. Yeah. Which I also get. You want a break every once in a while. But I, I, I disagree. I think that it's a disconnect. I think they don't give a fuck how happy the kid is. Yeah. It doesn't even fucking matter to them how amazing this is to their kids. I don't think they give a fuck. Well, a lot of yeah. people just have kids because you hear about I read that all the time. It's like, oh, they had a very stern dad who was completely disconnected and never showed emotion. That is very foreign to me. Like when I held my kid for the first time, I was like, holy fuck, dude. This you is kiss like your kid on the mouth, right? Yeah. That's my dad. My dad was the foreign disconnect. Yeah, it, that's that very yeah. crazy to me. Like, I'm so like right. engaged with my kid right. that like when you see parents that just don't give a fuck or they yell at them or they're very like kind of like I hear next door there's a person that's like like really violent with her kids. Really, and it's like nonstop I hear her fucking yelling at him, screaming yeah. at him, hitting him, and it's just like how the fuck are you a parent? How, that how? might be Puerto Ricans fucking. <laughs> Ooh, mommy, spank. Hey, you'll never lease it. Let me ask you this question, though. Did you ever think that you and you and maybe you because you're getting married, you might be thinking about this, but maybe that if we're so nice to them and so that we treat we we do such a good job that they're not going to be funny or creative exactly. or because if you look at comics, especially. We're funny because of our fucked up lives. Yeah. Yes. We, we, you either fucking go this way and fight and kill and murder, or you go that way and make people laugh or make yourself laugh, right? Right. So I, I'm like worried. Is my kid just going to – am I not – like am I making just a normal fuck? Well, yeah, Adrian's got a daughter, a so there's what, no you? funny there. Yeah. But <laughs> uh, <laughs> want to throw this orange at him? I would rather I would rather <laughs> have a normal kid who's adjusted than somebody who needs to seek out attention from people. I mean, that's a, we need attention. That's true. And it's it's not always fucked up people that become comics, but mm -hmm. there is a need for attention or there's a need for some sort of yeah. you know uh, gratification, validation. So yeah, I mean, if you're not getting that at home, as simple as your dad not paying a lot of attention to you. Yeah. Um. Yeah, but no, I would rather my kid be fucking normal. I'd rather my yeah. kid be. I, I had a good childhood. I, yeah. I, I, I didn't feel that I was suffering. I was suffering for other things, but my, my parents, they were okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like lack of. <laughs> but you didn't suffer, but you're not funny. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen your act. I'm joking. We literally just smashed you. Mine didn't get yeah. a big 11. I, I think it's, it's my first time in the show, so it's fair. Next but time I will fight with we, we won't boxing anyone. But we won't understand. <laughs> Lewis is yeah. looking him up and, and down. And there's not a next time. You need to go back and do it. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Is there like a set on YouTube we could tear apart right now? Or, I mean, no. That'd be uh, good. What the fuck is wrong with you? I mean, I just <laughs> want to 
Let me ask you, do they do, they do that? And like, because um, this is what I hear about like French Canadian comedians all the time. They'll just like steal jokes from American comics and just uh, do them in French. I've and seen just that. Make it, yeah, right, listen, do you I've see that, that in, in your country? That. I've seen that and I couldn't believe it. That I, I, uh, one comic. I I'm saying it's a great idea. You should do it. I, I, <laughs> I, I, I went to the comic and I said, look, uh, this is very similar, for not saying a translation, of Pablo Francisco routine. Oh, and they're stealing uh, shitty jokes, yeah. too. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing the movie phone voice in uh, no, no, Spanish. They, <laughs> blah, 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 blah. They, they did a Schwarzenegger <laughs> uh, blah, tortilla blah, blah, boy. Blah, blah. The tortilla boy is quite famous. You're not allowed to say Schwarzenegger because yeah. hey. we don't really understand. <laughs> right. Hey, all right, listen, we're going to take a break real quick. i got to take a piss. we got to do some ads, right? Yeah. Yeah. I gotta do some reads, and then we're coming back for a half hour or so, and we'll be back out. But I do want to talk about uh, thievery, and I want to talk about uh, uh, fucking our new president, Donald Trump. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. yeah. Trump. When we come back. So uh, we'll be back. You guys, um, we're going to go right to the chat room. You have any questions about the last hour or what the fuck you want to ask anybody in here, put them up, and we're going to do Lauren's chat. Okay. Okay? Pussy chat. Uh, um, <laughs> all right. chat. The cavernous <laughs> chat. We'll be back right after this. Go ahead. We're back. All right. Check this out, people. People. Oh, I don't know. Not now. Uh, all right. Check it out here. Um, this is it. Golf first major is right around the corner. I actually have grown to like golf, maybe because I'm older, but... I do. I don't mind throwing it on on an afternoon. I just wish I could smoke in my house a nice fat bat. I might get an outside TV. But uh, here's the deal. The first major is right around the corner, and you can play one-week fantasy golf. That's how great DraftKings is right now for free. You can play for free at DraftKings.com. Just pick six golfers. I love this. You can bet on golf. Stay under the salary cap and rack up points for streaks per hole per firm performance. Right, tournaments, finishes, whatever you want. Check that out. You can. There's a bunch more you can do. Whatever, whatever you can bet in golf, you can bet. Outscore the competition, and you could win big every single tournament. Whether you live and breathe golf, or you just want, you know, you just want to try it, have a new fantasy sport. DraftKings brings the excitement of the game to the whole new level with every monster drive and made putt, bringing you closer to victory. Millions of sports fans have already discovered DraftKings. Now it's your turn, brother. All right, check this out. Contest begins when the tournament tees off. So here's what you're going to do. Go to DraftKings.com and choose your golfer now. Right now. Go do it. This isn't fantasy as usual. This is DraftKings, brother. Use promo code Kelly at DraftKings.com and play for free. I need you to do that. Here's the thing. They throw us some cash to promote this to you, and you use Kelly, okay, at DraftKings.com, and you get to play for free. So we all, it's a win-win-win. That's the promo code, Kelly, for free entry now. Only at DraftKings.com. That's DraftKings.com. I want to let you guys know that uh, I want to thank the people at Vader Sticks, my, my boy Chad. And Chris over at Sabian Symbols fucking hooked me up big time. And the guys over at uh, Ludwig. These amazing guys over at uh, Dark Horse Drums, too. Um, everybody's been fucking super, super nice to me. So I want to appreciate that. Um, and I want to say, go right now, drycast.com. We have an amazing new show called uh, Misery Loves Company that is fucking Wait, killing it. It's killing it. I can't tell you. It's... Off the fucking, I mean, I, you know, you got, you got, uh, I'm so proud of the network right now. Unbelievable. Florentine, we got uh, Nick DiPaolo, we got News Whore, Mandy Statmiller, Rich and Bonnie, the Bailey J Show, we got the Comedy Sellers co live at the tables coming back, and we got uh, Misery Loves Company, just, just to name a few. It's, it's fucking hilarious. Go check it out. Subscribe, review. Uh, and uh, there you go. Uh, we're back into the show right the fuck now. All right, check it. What's up? We're back. Ch 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 check it. Uh, oh, Scopo's not here. Let's. Should we wait for him? Oh, oh no. No, he'll be a oh, few minutes. Oh, 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 oh. 
Oh, really? What the fuck are you talking uh, about? That was just a joke. Oh. Oh. <laughs> like, the show, like the show would stop. Uh, before we left, we were talking about a bunch of shit. Um, and th- uh, here's the real fucking thing. First of all, I, t- I said we we're going to go right to the chat. So let's go to the chat real quick. All right. What Big, do we got? Big Dick wants to know who on the podcast will be the next to die. And a mega tech guy says Gomez, di- Gomez dies by a knife fight outside the cellar. Well, he'd have to get booked at the cellar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and he'd have to be able to afford a knife. Oh, oh you make money. Sorry. Money. You can get a nice knife. Like uh, Bob, a- imagine I'm just making a joke that's untrue about you over and over again. <laughs> like Bobby's that? skinny. You Bobby's skinny. You're fat. <laughs> <laughs> you're fat. <laughs> we just if I kept on <laughs> making skinny jokes about Bobby all day, at one point you're like, dude, yeah, I, mean, but what money, I am fat. But what money is to you and what money is to me is different. No, yeah, you make substantially more money than me, but you've yeah, been comedy money, for 42 years. Your money's not really money. It's okay. And, and Bobby's got a money, big tax. Yeah. I am doing. Hold on. I'm mean? doing financially better than any other comic at my level. How about in this room? I'm. I might be. I might be doing better than. Then Mark. Maybe. Mark Norman makes a lot know, of no, money. No, no, Norman. Norman does the road a lot. What about him? Schumer money. This too. guy makes pesos. I don't know. I could be. Do- <laughs> I could be doing better than uh, Buddy, Berg. I'm, I'm just fucking kidding. Well, no. The point is, you keep on making the same fucking joke, and at one point, I gotta go. Hey, guys, I'm not actually fucking poor. I'm not actually not getting paid to do yeah. things. Buddy, I got a radio live, show. I have two podcasts that make money. In, I do stand up every single. You fucking live in night. Manhattan. The road. Well, who gives a shit? What? But who cares? I care. Why? Because. Why? Because. Why? Because. 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 The world. One of the things we Jingle. 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 Watch Bobby so joyously move his arms. The gayest. I'm gonna put that in slow motion. Just watch his tits going up and down. Bobby's like those old ladies in the There's a video. There's a video of me, probably at my fattest. Yeah. Cause th- I this mean, this morning. I, <laughs> <laughs> right, so it was my. It was almost at my face. By the way, you're gonna be sore from throwing that orange. <laughs> I was spitting water on my computer. Well, I uh, Ugh, need I'm not Tommy gonna, John surgery after that. So did me, literally, like in bikini underwear, some weird. Couldn't even see the shorts I was wearing, yeah. and me just dancing. Oiled up with like just suntan oil in the uh, sun, yeah. and I'm going tummy to tummy tip to tip. And my other friend was lying on a lounge chair, and I just danced over him tummy to tummy tip to tip. And I I put my belly button on his belly button and my dick on his, and I just lied on top of him. And I was going tummy to tummy tip to tip. Singing the song. There's a video of that. Somewhere. Please, can you find it? it? It's like the no. Chris Farley Chippendales no. video. <laughs> yeah, worse. <laughs> Um, what else we got? Um, did Norman ever fuck that Sports Illustrated model from Obi and Jim? Yeah, did you? Oh, man, I tried. You were really fucking mean to her. Yeah, well, she was being a cunt. Yeah, but they like that, though. They like when you're mean yeah. to them. Who's they? Women. We Hot do. women. Yeah, women yeah. really like like <laughs> If you're a dick to a chick, yeah. that immediately gets her pussy wet. Speaking 100%. of dicks, if you're going to send dick pics in, which they did this week, mm-hmm. uh, what's the what's your email address? Producer at YKWD. Yeah, producer at YKWD. Don't send them to me, <laughs> okay? Even though I couldn't stop looking at these <laughs> strange, <laughs> beautiful cocks you sent. Yeah. I, didn't even, I, I didn't even know dicks look like that. <laughs> like, oh, really? Yeah, there was just... Probably uh, hasn't they, seen his in years. Dude, if you're going to make jokes <laughs> about my dick, make it facts, okay? <laughs> <'Cause>, <laughs> oh, the old turnaround. <laughs> um, so, yeah, please send them to them. Go ahead. Uh, yeah, so what were you saying? Um, yeah, so you never fucked her. No, I tried, but I, I got yeah. some good jokes off her, so that was yeah. almost as good. What's the deal with not fucking hot chicks? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that was a pretty good people? Norman. I don't know. I don't get yeah. it. Hey, this chick wouldn't fuck me. Yeah. Ah, she's going to fuck me. So, you know, yeah. I killed her. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, yeah. give it up for Amy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this political correctness is getting to us, huh? <laughs> I, I don't like that he's getting nerdier and nerdier. Yeah. Um, hey, want to take a shot? <laughs> I yeah, don't know try. how to say um, uh, He's just on his phone, so uh, excited. Ooh. In America, on thing called podcast. <laughs> I was doing that the internet I... is so fast here. <laughs> a lot of explaining. What is podcast? Well, the internet. What is internet? Well, a computer. What is computer? <laughs> you see, can see you, a little can kid. You <laughs> see a little kid filling a bucket in a lake. Right, right. Yeah. Um, all right. Yeah. Okay. Mayonnaise wants to know Munster or mozzarella. Mayonnaise. For Bobby. Mayo maize. Oh. Uh, what do you uh, want? What's the maize. question? Monster or mozzarella as a cheese? Mozzarella. Mozzarella. Yeah. 
I would say mozzarella. I mean, yeah. on what though? Is yeah. It going I mean, on a, yeah. Is it melted? Yeah. Melted. Yeah, it's mozzarella. Know. Regular. It's fucking munts. I always right. picture Munster being just a black cheese. Because when I lived in Harlem, I'd get people. I'd hear people be like, "Yo, give me a turkey and monster." Yeah. And they call it monster. I've never eaten monster. Monster's cheese. a good cheese. Good, good cheese. cheese. I think it's more versatile than mozzarella. Yeah, yeah. it's good on a sandwich. Yeah. yeah. I can't believe we're taking this question. That really? You know, I'm, I'm off a of cheat. My cholesterol was through the roof. They put me on statins. Why were you? Why? No more cheese. Because all I did was eat fucking fat and protein for two years. My insides are rotten. Do oh, not wow. do that diet. Really? What, not last diet? That. What? What, what, did yeah. what do you do? Yeah. Last what do you do? Australia. I change everything. Now it's no fat. I can eat carbs. I can eat sugar. I eat fish. You're doing primarily. a no fat diet. No fat. That's crazy. Wow. Yeah. I mean, what? a couple of you, you, you can do the real ass diet. So, as long as you're eating a lot of fruit and vegetables, no, you're fine. Fat dude. fucked up my No, you don't want to have a ton yeah, of that, cheese that and that red meat. That could be her, uh, hereditary. It though. is hereditary, but I never had that problem before that diet. All of the studies right now that are out, they're saying a high fat, high protein diet is the healthiest, and all of your vitals are, are great. I dude, but look, I don't, it's out there. I don't, but, right I, but I don't eat, like, because I. I don't. I don't eat. What the fuck? You should be eating lean meats, and you should be. You shouldn't be doing all fat in your diet. But if you're, you're doing right. your your largest portion should be from vegetables, and then you're doing lean proteins, and you're doing a little bit of fat. That's fine. Yeah. You could have. You could have cheese. You could have whole milk. Fat is healthy. Fat. No. There's nothing wrong. I've with fat. cut. I've cut cheese. I've cut whole milk. All fat. I'm cutting out because it raises my cholesterol. I know my cholesterol's gone down since I changed my diet. You're no. You're right. You shouldn't. Here's the thing. No. In reality. You should be eating from the earth. You shouldn't be what eating about processed not, like, What about in like the fourth dimension? Not in reality. <laughs> <laughs> the what? <laughs> I, just hate, I hate when I get fucking MMA Lewis. Uh-huh. Fucking his serious show, Lewis. Not- in reality, the substantial fucking requests of the uh, national... Well, I know what I'm talking about. All right, shut well, up. Yeah. Now you I look, per- I look better now. You took the bomb. Now you got the bam- permanently? What? Like what it changed with your diet. Now it's... Permanent. What is forever? Permanent? What do you mean? Like your insides are. No, I'm fat. bringing it down. I'm oh, bringing okay. it. Da- you change your diet. You you alter your body. That's what happens. Your body can heal. You are what yeah. you eat. Yeah. If that I never should have took a break. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck you guys. Really? I let the air out of this fucking show. Yeah. I'm, I'm struggling. I put the one with the captain's hat back on. Do you need that? Yeah. Yeah, I like that. Just sit right back there with hair. He does kind of look like that. Like <laughs> A three-hour <laughs> pod. <laughs> oh, shit. You're Gilligan. Yeah. yeah who uh, are you? Skip uh, you're the I'm Gilligan. Ginger. You're the I'm coconut. Not nice. the millionaire. Lewis <laughs> 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 is poor. Lewis <laughs> <laughs> is poor. Lewis <laughs> is poor. Dude, it's not true. <laughs> Look, I've got forty dollars. <laughs> I have a metro card that's always full. <laughs> Fuck you! I have eight free podcasts. <laughs> None of my podcasts are free. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh shit! I didn't know that. What? What'd you say? I said, uh, I said, Legion. You have to pay for the, the exclusive access oh, to both shows. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You have to pay for real ass dude. Uh, no, not yet. But you have to pay we're, for hammer we're, fisting. We're, we're, hammer fisting's over. We're launching. Well, we're gonna. We're actually yes. We're relaunching hammer fisting on the Gas Digital Network. It will be exclusive wow. to Gas Digital. So yeah, you have to pay to get hammer. So fisting. many pods. So you're, you're gonna have to pay. Wait a minute. So how's how's this going? So what do you mean? Pods. You're gonna pay for hammer fisting? Here's the way it works. Gas Why would you Digital, do that? It, Well, I'm gonna tell you. Um, the, it's gonna be one of the. F- exclusive podcasts we have a bunch of podcasts that we're going to offer for free on itunes a handful of episodes mm-hmm. and then if you pay the exclusive access which is a small fee you get what's live. the fee can i ask what the fee is <laughs> you, know, you can't announce it yet you don't <laughs> mark mark, uh, uh, mark. Oh, sorry i blacked out this mark. is very interesting mark <laughs> tuesdays with snorries <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Fucking Christ. Uh, I thought he was the dad. Aaron, we're not, we're not pun guys, Aaron. We got to come with energy. All right. <laughs> I like puns. I like puns, too. Yeah, so do I. I'm saying they don't accept them from, like, a muscly bald guy. Mm. They don't like it. <laughs> you really do look ridiculous. I know. It's weird. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me happy, you know. It's what I wanted as a child, and I live with it. Wait, I'm, I'm going to take this hat off. Good for you. It's actually too hot. You did it. I did it. So, anyways, um... You get you know, whistles from gays? I bet gays would love you. Fuck Chicks yes. have been looking at me like crazy oh. now. That's because they know yeah. you're engaged. Yeah, they know I'm engaged. Yeah. I'm fucking swatting away pussy like <laughs> fucking... Oh, it's crazy. Wow. That, 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 that's that's pussy. Women in love Laura being married. Zooming in on you in the yeah. camera. And the stroller. It's, also it's the upper chest. This but I've been called it, a fag. To you? I What's got that? called a fag at 40 seconds. To attract women. Everyone have a separate conversation Hang on one second. Pay attention to the fucking show. 
Yeah. Uh, Go ahead. When you Did are she? married, yeah. and then you have this trailer with your kid, women yeah. are like, oh, I want to fuck that. You kid. are the alpha, the daddy. Yeah. Because exactly because you you can procreate, like your thing works, and also you are in a relationship, so you are not afraid of that. So women are very well, yeah. yeah. Biologically, women go, oh, I want that guy to take care of me. That's a thing. That's why women like funny guys, they like rich guys, smart guys. Yeah. It's because it's like. In their head, instinctually, or in their body, physiologically, they go, I want to be taken care of. Mm -hmm. So I should well, cheat. N not, not really, not, <laughs> not only funny, that. A woman can have what? It's funny, it's a sign of intelligence. Uh, okay. 20 or 30 <laughs> kids in, in their life. Like, I mean, they can have 20 in or 30 that's the opportunities to have uh, from what is 15 to 40. You said how many kids? Laura could have? have 90 <laughs> kids <laughs> with her vagina. Spit them out. They come out like this. <laughs> We can have as many as we want. <laughs> they try like a swish through a basketball hoop. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually a backwards sound. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, yeah. What were we doing? <laughs> what? Oh, the oh, baby no. stroller. I think this fucking daddy. Yeah. 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 Every girl wants a daddy. Really? No. I don't yeah. know. You know, I think we also discourage <laughs> women now from being moms, being housewives. Like the the, the truthfully, women instinctually. They want to take care of things. It's the truth. Sure. I know. It's just and, when, and you, uh, when you start using big words. What? It Instinctually makes, is a big word? <laughs> to me, it is. To you, for me, yes, it is. <laughs> it just makes me laugh. Because well, I, 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 you know, I'm sorry. It's, you, go ahead. What about all these chicks now who are like, oh, I don't want kids. I don't, you hear that a lot. I girls. think that's a fucking defect. I think when women say I don't want to have kids, I think that there's fucking, something wrong with that. You're hanging with Gavin McGinnis too much. No, I'm not hanging with Gavin at all. It's the truth. I mean, if you, men too, if you say I don't want to have kids ever, you are going against your nature. It's interesting, nature you, exactly. it's interesting you say that because there are some guys that I know that are never going to hear. Joe I know guys that are never going to have kids or I know guys that are never going to be in a fucking relationship. So what happens? You, okay, your 50s, fine. 60s, 70s, 80s, the end of your life and you're alone. Mm -hmm. It's like, I don't know, that fucking scares the fuck fuck out of me but you know what's funny on the other end is this now funny or am i gonna laugh at this no no, no. no. Oh, it's not funny you know it's crazy though thank you i uh it's crazy <laughs> She's i serious. on the other end i go now that i got a kid there's this weird thing where i'm like fuck dude i'm gonna have to deal with dying and he's gonna lose me i'm gonna have to deal with maybe him being hurt at one point and now i have to go to the hospital because yeah. my kid got hurt in basketball practice or fucking got hit by a car yeah that is really scary as well yeah. and that nobody really ever, ever tells you that and that's the only thing that i don't like about parenthood well everybody tells you that everybody says you're gonna worry about this fuck for the rest of your life now once you have that kid you're gonna think about him dying all the time. It sucks. It's really. You oh, think about oh, your kid it's fucking it's every hard. time really? a car goes fucking by hard. in front of my house, I'm like, I just picture Max going, da, and running and thunk. Yeah. And this oh, scene from wow. uh, Pet Cemetery, <laughs> which yeah. is running through it, and there's a yeah. truck careening down the road. <laughs> Dude, yeah. that, we used to make fun of that scene yeah. as kids. Oh. Now that I got a kid, I can't even watch that, dude. Oh. It breaks my wow. heart, dude. The yeah. little, and he's three, he's exactly James' age, and the fucking thing just crashes into him, and you see the little fucking yeah. bo like, boot roll like, down the street. I Ooh. can't imagine, like, uh, like people, like, kids drowned, you know? Oh. I remember the story. They went, home, they, went, they went to their summer house. Their little fucking two-year-old found a hole in the fence, crawled through it, went in the pool, and just the, died in the neighbor's pool. Ooh. And they're, look, they're not even looking for him. And that's why my wife, I'm like, you fucking keep your eyes on that fucking kid. Yeah. He should never, ever be the fuck out of your sight. Yeah. I'm putting a fence in my backyard. Because yeah. I don't... I, he, the other day, I'm, I'm watching him, and then she took over, and then all of a sudden, he's out front. And it's like, whoa. Yeah. yeah. It happens that fast. Yeah. You're like, Max, Max, Max. Max. Wow. And they don't... They don't fucking know. No. That, that's why no, the suburbs no. are kind of scary, too, because in the city, you ne like, there's never a time where he's like on a fucking city block yeah. by yeah. himself. He's always holding my have hand. You seen, have you seen the kids like walking? In, like, I've like, seen Even that. the school kids, they walk like little ducklings holding each other's hands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. it's... it's it well, is. in the suburbs, when you don't, you don't think about it. You're like, oh, they could run around the yard or whatever. Yeah. I remember when I was a kid, though, we, I was out front. I yeah. was in the too. street Me at too. four, nobody nobody knew where the fuck and I was. I was in yeah. the woods. Me I was too. running yeah. around down the block and beat yeah. up by some fucking yeah. racist yeah, white fucking kids. Yeah, but fucking Monte Carlo was coming. It was made of steel. <laughs> it was fucking. There was yeah. no sensors. <laughs> right. It was just barreling down the street with fucking playing yeah. Led Zeppelin, and I and we were just in the street. Do you remember when we were fucking first started driving? How reckless we oh, were. Oh, the drinking alone. Dude, I was just fucking stupid. We would just have races down the fucking side yeah. of a yeah. suburban yeah. cul-de-sac. We couldn't have burnouts. Oh my god, dude. All it took was one little fucking three-year-old to run out in front of the yeah. car and it, we, they're gonna explode like a deer Buddy, i over. used to get yeah. around in boston in the winter time when i was like 10 
grabbing the in the on the snow, grabbing a bumper. We did that too. And that was great. I, oh, I would go from one town to the next just on a sh- bumper. Yeah. Just fucking, we called it mushing. Uh-huh. Yeah. Grab on the side of a bus. At any moment I fall, I'm fucking, there's a car yeah. Yeah. a foot behind yes. me. I'm just dead. We did that with rollerblades. Someone... We grab on the back of the bus and we go from that's West Haverstraw to fucking the Nanyuan. To another gay Someone did that to parade. me in the city yeah. the other day. <laughs> Someone get the back of me on rollerblades in the back of my car. I pulled the car over. Yeah. I was like, I don't want to. They got in the guy. back of your car? No, yeah. And they just, they, they were What'd following my car. I would get out. I pulled the car over. I was like, kiss Get that bag in his face. <laughs> Get off my Why? fucking bumper, queer. Why are you holding on to my bumper, you psychopath? And you still have rollerblades? Get the fuck out of here. I just got a new car. Ooh, What'd you get? Oh, it's nice. I got a... It's, it's fucking nice. hot. It's what are we talking? Prius? I got Ford Edge Sport. Oh, top boy. of the line, every fucking option you could possibly get. It parks know, itself. What is a Ford Edge? I don't know Par- what it's, it's a big SUV. It's not a big one. It's not the big one. It's not... It's the middle one. There's the little one... And then the big one, mine's a little one. It's in the middle, and it's uh, leather seats, leather heated. leather suede seats, suede heated, heated and cooled. My wow. seats are AC. Jesus. So there's an AC button. So you it's you got a sunroof, dude. It's the whole sunroof. The oh, whole roof. the big moon roof that yeah. open. Yeah, it's the whole roof. Yeah, is the car sunroof. parks itself. That's how Bobby gets yeah. in and out of the car. So what do you do? Well, to park na- it? Now he will do the Argentinian thing. I never heard of cold seats. Oh yeah, heated what seat is it? Car? Never heard His seat is always it. heated. Let's be honest. <laughs> <laughs> it's a warm fucking seat. <laughs> What'd you say? <laughs> what is a car? Um, <laughs> you mean you don't have to use your you feet to get it going? You just, <laughs> what do you do? You you go to the car in what? front and then you just push it and it parallel parks it? You, you're in the car and it, it uh, perpendicular and parallel. So you can pull in, you, pull, you push the button and then you have to drive and it looks for a spot. When it finds a spot, stop. And then you just let go of the wheel. Fuck and then it just parks for you. Parks the, the car, car. Oh, parks. Awesome. I literally oh, stuck damn. my hands out the sunroof and it fucking just parked the car. Dude, it fingers your wife for you? Like, it's <laughs> the best. Oh, great. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's got... It's fucking crazy, dude. So when you're driving, if there's uh, a, any car in your blind spot lights up on the wind on the Jesus. So it tells you that. How yeah. far do you think I got you a, are? I got a front camera that sees around corners. Oh my so when God. you're coming out of a parking garage or something, you hit that, and it will look around the corner. So you know when you come out of the garages mm-hmm. in New York and you can't see the bike coming or the yeah. fucking idiot on a skateboard? Yeah. You can see that. Wow. That's wow. Right. Everything yeah. is clear, Bobby. <laughs> and then... Uh, talks to you? Yeah, it's got fucking... It. How far Every, you, has internet. How far do you think we are off from having the car just literally you typing your destination? They have it now. They have it now. They have and that. then it just goes. You're, they have you're, it now, but they have it... Here's the thing, and, and, it, and, and I'll say this with this car... You have to, you know, it's not going to, you know, it, it has these sensors, but if a fucking truck flips in front of you. Right. All right, right so like right, my car, right. I'm coming down the road going over the Whitestone Bridge, and I'm flying. All of a sudden, there's a traffic jam. You ever have that where you're flying, and there's just, uh, where there's not no traffic. Yeah. All of a sudden, it's a dead stop, and you're like, I'm, I'm fucking dead. Yeah. We're dead. Someone's dying. That, and my car senses that. And sl- breaks for you, and the light goes off in the front. It goes, beep, 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 and it scares the fuck out of you. But it it literally slows the car down. So if I'm in cl- cruise control, it automatically will sense that and s- uh, just stop the car. Yeah. And hey, uh, they just said a uh, Chinese tech company is going to try to make it uh, commercial viable by 2018. Wow, I think that's awesome. Wow. Yeah, I, I think that's great, dude. Okay, Auto, autopilot just I like it. I like it. Uh, I, well, I, you that takes now, away some up. of the joy of driving. I, totally. nice car. No, I don't know. My car actually has the manual paddles on the wheel, so I can go back and shift it myself too. Because yeah. I used to love. Uh, I love a shift. Um, I used to love that a shifter. I used yeah. to love, so I have both. But I think that it, the new Tesla that's coming out, it's going to be thirty thousand dollars electric wow. car, five hundred miles. That's only one third of what I make per year. <laughs> Everyone. <laughs> so you could get you could get one. I could buy three of those this year. Yeah. Yeah, you could get one, but you'd have to get somebody to co-sign a loan. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> your credit still stinks. But uh, <laughs> actually, also not true. All right. Fuck. Can we have any fun with you? It's nope. funny when you're poor. Yeah. It's, <laughs> it's not funny when you're rich. Yeah. It's not better when you're doing. I'm not. Good. No, I'm not rich. So, okay. uh, none of us in this room are fucking rich. No. None of us. Um. Yeah, the th- 500 miles on one charge, which is damn. The, that's crazy. Yeah. Now you can go to Boston. Right. Right? And then uh and it's going to drive itself. They actually have a car right now. Mercedes has a car out that you can buy and when you're on the highway, you can hit the button and it will drive. It will fucking just drive and you can just talk to the person in front of you. 
Oh, and so just crazy. hang out. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I mean, I get what you're saying about having control. Yes. That's why I'd rather drive I, than use the subway. Um, but still, it is pretty cool if you just want, if you're tired, right? You're just like, dude, I don't want to fuck. You think about how many times at night you're like, your oh, eyes are sure. going to close coming back from a gig. You're yeah. like, dude, I don't want to have to really pay attention that much. How great is it to just go fucking put it in, take me there. Yeah, but I love it. Can you fall asleep? Now. Yeah. Dude, you'll be able to fall. Like, okay, so I'm coming out of my car. The, all right, the next Ford that comes out. I can start my car from the house, right? The next uh, Ford uh, uh, computer that's going to be in there. So you get off a plane. You'll be able to go to your Ford app, push the button. It will start your car in the garage of the airport. or wherever, yeah. and, and then come and pick you up at the gate? But No, no, no. They have that. But That'll they, happen. They'll, they'll have that wow. where it will come find you. But um, I, think it's, th I think it's Tesla is coming out with that. Where you're going to push a button and it will come to where your fucking wow. phone is. Wow. Yeah. They said by 2020, they're going to have 10 million self-driving cars. That's wow. going to be the Jeez. weirdest thing. will be just watching cars with no one in them. Yeah. And you're like, what the fuck is going on? The car's coming around again. What is that, Gary Vee in there? I, I, <laughs> I fucking love it. I can't wait for that. Yeah, I, I can't that. wait. I ha Let me tell you something right now. I got the, how, how great was my Alexa? Oh, that shit was awesome. I have, a, yeah. I have an Amazon Echo. Yeah. Which Echo. is, I think, 170 you can buy off of Amazon. Yeah. It, it's the shit. What's it? What echo? is it? A smart car? It's like Siri, but you just put it on your it, counter, and then a, you go, Alexa, what's this, this, this? Oh. Yeah, that's what you have to Wait, bring Wait, one in. of Google's cars. That? That's what you have to bring in, Alexa. Why? So we can talk to her. Uh, oh, we yeah. don't need more yeah. women right. on the this show. This is a friend? One of Google's uh, self-driving cars crashed into a bus. No, yeah. that happened, uh -huh. but, that, but that's got to happen. <laughs> yeah, but that's, I guarantee you, how many fucking idiots are crashing into buses? So it's easy just to go, oh, shit, one of the self-driving cars did it. But yeah, you're going you're gonna to have accidents. I but promise it's going to be safer than... Idiots that don't know how to drive. But well, here's what's going to happen: the car is going to go the speed limit. Yes, I was going to say. So that. you're That's not going to. Yeah. No, it's not a problem. It's actually good because not for me. The people that are on the highway are going to fucking be doing the speed limit now, instead yeah. of fucking lunatics doing right. ninety. But then <laughs> cops don't give tickets, and the government, uh, the state won't have money from tickets. Well, yeah. and then this, this yeah. is going to also Fuck get. Em. This is where it's also going to get kind of crazy because then when they start implementing it, where everybody has to do it, which I could see them creating some sort of regulations yeah. where like. This yeah. is a safer way to do it. Then it becomes a little bit weird, you know. It's freedom. You yeah, can't, you can't. I want to drive my own car, and they're saying no. You have to drive this car. Yeah, they, they'll never do that. It's always going to be an option, and I and in these cars, it's an option to have it drive yourself. We'll see, man. But for truck drivers, you're exhausted. You're fucking tired. Yeah, but, that, but you things, you can. Dude, I wish they had a lot of Mercedes. Years. Mercedes is, are, trucks are so big. It's gonna take time for that to happen. No, they have, Mercedes has one. A truck, dude. A truck where you push a button, autopilot. It fucking drives, yeah. and the the chair the chair actually moves back, turns sideways, and becomes a bed. What? You can literally just take a fucking nap. If you have the sensors wow, on my man. car, can park it. Can you be a drunk though? In that case, would they allow you to drink and drive? Because no, you're not, not driving. Why not. though? They wouldn't yeah. allow it. If you could it. sleep, but you're not allowed to have a fucking Don't yell at us. Maybe, Don't yell at us. It's Puerto Rican <laughs> questions about cars. <laughs> <laughs> can you rape in a car? <laughs> 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 Yeah. I'm not a rapist. The computer made me do it. <laughs> Let it be known, guys. I don't actually rape. All right, we know oh, you don't. On. You're rich, I have you a lot rape. of money. I don't rape. Okay. <laughs> Anymore. <laughs> rich <laughs> Lewis doesn't rape. Ever since I got into the new tax bracket, yeah. I fucking You'll be raping, raping again when you get that car. I got this new, I, I tell you, I got this fucking Alexa. It's, you put it on your table in, in the kitchen. It jumps onto your internet. It hooks up to your Google calendar. You, I got an app for it. You, you literally just go, Alexa, what am I doing today? Tells you your fucking schedule. Alexa, how much traffic? There's an hour and 45 if you go to the side. Alexa, wow. uh, it, it, anything, whatever. You want to spell, what, you want to know a fact. How much money does Lewis make? <laughs> uh, that is not documented. <laughs> um, yeah, it's it's fucking amazing. Yeah, the self, it, and it's only, what's that? Self-driving truck, yeah. They talk, they're talking about it now. It's yeah. Oh, there you there go. Yeah, yeah. Say so, bye to trucker meth. Well, it's it's fucking great. I think the technology is great, and that they, j I mean, the well, Boston also, Robotics. If you, they, you know, they had that oh, dog. That's amazing. Yeah. Fuck that. They actually got mother, a uh, one that stands up and walks now, like a human. Yeah. Yeah. Opens a door. I saw that. And you can't kick it down. They have a motorcycle, okay, that you get in it like a car, and it cannot be knocked. If a car hits it. It still doesn't get knocked Just over. Slice so your leg off. Like a gyroscope. Well, it, it keeps it's it up. A, exactly. Ah, the downside is that people will lose jobs. For example, the oh. truck self-driving. No, nah, but they'll make no, no, jobs. No, no. You, you're gonna technology. always need a human being behind the wheel. Yeah, and also beyond that, yeah, look, how long? Bobby, really? Bobby, look at the photo. 
There's a guy's driving. No, a truck. I, I, he's I agree. Having, that's his iPad he's holding. I think he's yeah. controlling. Oh, no, yeah. I, I agree. I agree with him because you will end up. Eventually, it will be just self-driving trucks. One day down the road, I guarantee that's the case. We're gonna have. You can press a button. But the truth is, how many jobs are you creating by creating an entire industry you're not gonna be on of high-end technology? You're, exactly, but you're not going to be alive. I guarantee you will. You I'll won't be alive because you're going to have a heart attack, but he'll probably be alive for at least 40 more years. <laughs> there, uh, uh, no, he's not. He's the fucking Argentinian steaks. Have you seen those? <laughs> <laughs> this guy's cholesterol is worse than this fucking Jews over here. But yeah, all, all that, the idea that robots will take everyone's jobs, that's just creating new industries. Technology only helps it changes, the industry. It, it does, but it, it's going to take away jobs from fucking just those blue collar guys. Yeah, but there's it's going to give jobs to nerds like Mark and That's his That's not true. There's still going to be guys that are packing boxes in those fucking factories. No, they're not because I, the boxes are going to There's studies already, that have been done. They're, already, they're already fucking getting they're already using robots to fucking Amazon is robots. Yeah. There's nobody in the fucking they have very few people in the right. warehouse. So You're right. Amazon is hurting the economy, Bob. No, Amazon is is great for the economy. It's great for us, but their warehouses don't have people in them anymore. It's a fucking robot pallet that weighs it and brings it to the truck and goes on the truck. The the whole conveyor belt. Go to B&H Photo. Amazon uses that electronic uh, computer system to ship stuff all around. That used to be a guy. Well, loading, now they're also but, doing uh, the but drones. Used, but that used to be a guy loading a fucking box mm -hmm. a and putting it mm -hmm. on him. Exactly. It doesn't exist anymore. So yes, no, but I'm saying that, that blue one guy collar, loading a box. So that blue other, collar guy is gone. Is is getting true. out. He's gonna it's have not to, all engineers that are working at Amazon. There's still blue collar guys that are sweeping the floor. Of course there is. I'm not saying that it's over. But it, it's, it's creating but, way more but, jobs than it's taking away. Buddy, you're crazy. Tobles. There's one fucking person in the toll booth, and the rest are all easy pass. Those are all blue collar jobs, gone. State jobs. My wife's f uh, father was a toll booth guy. State job, pension, everything for the rest of his life, gone. Yeah. Why? Fucking technology. Okay. Gone. Yeah. Blue collar jobs will be replaced by fucking technology. It, when they learn how to fucking, when a guy can put a suit on and pick up a fucking a thousand pound box. They're not going to need five guys on a forklift. They're going to have one guy do it. I, I, think, I, mean, I think they're always yeah. going to have guys. I think it depends also in which part of society are you. I don't know if why you I have the getting... money to enjoy technology, I do. Well, so <laughs> it's good for us. It's good for us, but Lewis, if we are poor, we are Lewis losing has jobs. <laughs> that, that be, I, we're talking yeah. about me. We know. We know, Luis. We what know. about landscaping? Once they figure out how to make that. Dude, they, I, ha I almost bought... There's a fucking lawnmower right now that... <laughs> it's, it's, it's Miguel. You just say Miguel. Cut the lawn. <laughs> I have him. Uh, <laughs> seriously, it's a robot. So it's like the Roomba, a Rumba, whatever the uh -huh. fuck that is. You just put it in and it will mow your fucking lawn. That's oh, it. That's it. There's damn. no... There's fucking it. I have one... I have a, a, a chainsaw, a weed whacker of all the shit on one thing. What? Yeah, it's, a, it's, it's one battery, one thing. So technology's... Yeah. Taking scary. over fucking boy, jobs, man. Boy. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. And I, I love scary. it, though. I what's, fucking... It's not scary. I think it's great. What's going to happen when someone hacks into the computer and uh, fucks up the job? The, well, that's... They the, mow your lawn wrong. What's going to happen then? That'll be a horror movie. I already plot. got it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I love technology. I love it. I, the new robots they're going to have in your house is going to be fucking great for us. To be able to just ask it any questions creatively, to, to fucking be able to sit down and... And just have it do something. I mean, we can talk to our phones now, and you can do a text without typing while you're driving, right. without touching your phone. Voice. That's fucking. You, I mean, you really just went back like five years in technology. That's yeah. been around forever. Hey Siri, we're just talking came, about the future. Hey Siri, just came out this year. Hey what? Siri. Hey Siri, where you don't have to touch your phone. Where you just say if it's plugged in, you can just. Oh, now the new iPhones this year, you can just go, Hey Siri. And it automatically goes oh, on. I get it. You used to have to be able to touch it. You yeah. had to actually manually fucking do something. Mm -hmm. My Ale uh, Alexa, you don't have to fucking touch it. Anywhere in the house, just say Alexa, get your play hands Elvis. Off me, Bobby. <laughs> wow. well, Scopa, you're out of a gig soon. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you your own podcast producer. <laughs> break up Alexa soon. Yeah. Alexa, Fuck kill you, Chris Scopo. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Fuck but this. Bobby, he yeah. has nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I should rather. I should kill. Luis J. Gomez. He has sixty-two thousand dollars in the bank. Please give him the bump bandana. <laughs> <laughs> that joke stunk. Uh, 
<laughs> All right, let's get the fuck out of here, man. This has been a great show. Fun um, show. Yeah, really fucking. Thanks for coming on, dude. Aaron, right, thank you for having me. For what do you me. got, buddy? What do you got, Aaron, besides uh, fucking too much muscle? Uh, I'll be yeah. training arms this afternoon. at. Um, I'll be in uh, Poughkeepsie this Saturday at Laugh It Up Comedy Club. Come out and see that. Uh, That's a cool place, dude. Is it? Oh, a really should, cool hey, what place night are you cool. going? Uh, Saturday. Well, on your way back, maybe we'll hit the... Uh, Maybe we'll hit the porterhouse. Where's that in Jersey? It's over the Tappan Zee. Okay. Right over the right over the Tappan Zee in Montvale, and they're open till three. That's the place where we can smoke the steak inside. Steak and yeah. Okay, uh, yeah. I'll do that. All right. I'll well, that I said let's, right. let's L.A. it. Maybe. Okay. Um, let's not New York it where it's definite. Let's right. do maybe. We'll see what right. happens. Right. Next week, uh, March twenty fourth to twenty sixth, I'll be in Vancouver at Woo! Yuck Yucks headlining there. I want to work there. I met the guy. I'll tell them to book yeah. you. I do. I want to. Yeah. Co- I, I work that out. And uh, like nine thousand dollars to fly to Vancouver. Ask Alexa. <laughs> I, yeah, I got a stopover. I didn't get a direct flight. And uh, what about April thirtieth? I'm recording a new CD, Mr. Manners Live at the Standing Room uh, in Long Island City. Two shows. So come out and see that. And I'm You're on Twitter. You're doing the Standing Room. Aaron Bird terrible idea. What are you crazy? It's uh, like a live reading from the book, so it's oh, better to do it in an office oh, yeah. space. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, I thought it was a comedy. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's your book. You're reading a book. Yeah, but it's yeah. That sounds entertaining. Book. Regular yeah, David Sedaris over here. Yeah. yeah. Oh, he is so, a smart guy. Uh, that'll be great. Yeah. All right, buddy. Thanks Thank for coming you. on. Thanks for having me. What do you got there? Uh, I have my show April seventh, New York Comedy Club, the Argentinians Rancho. Okay. This Ooh. is the second show. So is it all uh, Argentinians? Uh, no, no. There is. I, I had in the first one. I, I I was supposed to have Mark, but he couldn't come. So I had Ari Shafir and Gary Vider. Yeah. Maybe right. the next I'd, one. I'd love you to know? do it. I'd love to do it. And uh, anyone that wants to come to oh the show, I'll throw that out. Yeah? Scopo's still here. And uh, <laughs> <laughs> I would love. I would love to come on. It's Scopo. Oh, yeah. I booked. I, nice. All please, right. If you want, announce that you are in the show. I can't work with Scopo though. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kidding. If I would do it. So yeah, uh, yeah and the first so one was a sold out show. Was a Great when show. is it? Wednesday? April? No, it's a Thursday. I I used to be on Saturdays, and they moved me to yeah, Thursdays because it was a sold out. So mm. they are like, yeah, it's yeah, good. Right. Right, cool. April seventh, eight p.m. Okay. Also, send twelve cents a day for his daughter. <laughs> <laughs> for the price just, of a cup of coffee. Or just buy a lime. Go on limes.com. <laughs> Bring an orange. <laughs> Lines. Lines. Ar. Hey, where's the best Argentinian steakhouse in New York? Have you found it? The thing is, th- that is a big thing that we we can discuss for half an hour. But I don't go to steakhouses. We don't we don't eat that in Argentina. What do you eat? Bugs. I, no, the thing is, the thing is, <laughs> the thing is, my mother used to prepare <laughs> steak every lunch. So for me, it's not, <laughs> such, it's not something such special. A, yeah. Lewis is such yeah. a dick. Uh, he's, like I, got, he's got I, dick down. I used to bugs. Eat, <laughs> I used to eat steak. Three, four times a yeah. week yeah. at my house. So for me, yeah. it's not something special. Yeah. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. So I don't go to stay houses. Yeah. And then when I we were taking hey clients. Buddy, hey, buddy. Can yeah. you, is it's a lot. Sta- I just want a steakhouse. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. The answer, the, the answer is like. Yeah, I just wanted I some fucking, some of your meat. <laughs> no wonder you've already gone <laughs> <done> an hour. <laughs> and my house with the family and my mother used. All right. Is that like a Brazilian steakhouse? The Argentinian? Argentinian? Like it's all you could eat? Argentinian steakhouse. No, it's not, it's the not same. A, it's not the same. It's not the same. But they have a, a it's, it's a skirt steak yeah. that kind of uh, you ever get the steak that kind of folds out and it's thin and yeah, long yeah. yeah it's my favorite steak ever mm-hmm. it's unbelievable and they cook yeah. we did a, we I, did a I big can tell you thing. two places in buenos aires where you will eat the best steak in your yeah. life go there let's but go to your well, life, i'll go yeah. let's go how far much go. i am going there? to be performing in argentina from middle april to all may i'll be at the chuckle hut in <laughs> santiago <laughs> right. I w- <laughs> literally a hut <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> i will be at the chicken shed <laughs> in my you, uncle's already, backyard, the comedy you, already, you already have the bombing, I, the bombing oh, bandana. Oh, <laughs> I will be, I will be doing two shows at the Emlo Mind. <laughs> All right, cool. <laughs> wow. Let's fucking let's. You gotta I'm, save it with the Amazonlimes.com. He called you out of the ball, but he tried to do another one. I'm gonna yeah. sink this fucking ship. Yeah. Yeah. I'm yeah. fucking yeah. taking yeah. this yeah. ship yeah. down yeah. as the captain. I was, I was playing violins yeah. as the ship's going down. Yeah. Lewis, what do you got besides nine? Uh, everybody, Million hold on to this. I'm a. Uh, uh, all right, I got live shows. Uh, April 8th, I'll be back on uh, Fox News Red Eye, so check that yeah. out, guys. Uh, April 15th and 16th, I will be up at the new Ha Comedy Club in Westchester. Yeah. Where is that? that out. It's just, uh, just opened up. Where? Uh, I don't know. Westchester. Somewhere in Westchester. Where in West- <laughs> Westchester's huge. 
All well, right. just fucking look up Hawk Comedy Club. I promise you could find it. Uh, <laughs> then I'll be in Los Angeles uh, April 17th through the 20th. What are you I'm doing, doing out there? Tony Hinchcliffe's um, Kill Tony and That's a bunch a of other one. shows. Really funny. Yeah. Uh, I'll be in Vegas from the 21st to the 23rd covering UFC 197. Wow. With who? Uh, with Mike Bisping. Doing the countdown. So you're doing the, the, the flying you out? Yeah. Serious? Yeah. Dude, I'm so happy for you. It's gonna be fun, dude. I really told you fun. that's where you fucking that's your pocket. No, that's I remember you telling me that I'm not that good at comedy and that I should just be doing MMA broadcasting. I remember. That, I never said that. I'll hold it. To I never said you were I'll good hold at it comedy. To my death. First that's of it. all, I never <laughs> said you were good at comedy. I I never. I think you're great you at comedy. I, it. I brought you. You made that up in your head. I've never said that. I'm kidding. I said, I'm only thanking two people on my album. You're one of them. I said you. You're great at MMA. You should fucking focus on that because yeah. you're really good at that. And you did. And now you're going to fucking cover the thing with Michael Bisbing. And you're fucking paying for you. I said that's why I initially liked you, because you're hammer fisting and your fucking dedication to the sport. And you know everything about it, and you're funny when you do it. And now it's paying off. So go fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Give me back my UFC bag I gave you. Oh, that, yeah, you did. Yeah, and the fucking jacket. Damn. Keep going. And the fucking other shirts. There's more. And the other jacket. <laughs> and the other bag. And the money. <laughs> and the time. <laughs> and the dedication I put into you. And the oh, orange shit. you threw at him. <laughs> uh, and then also we're doing next yeah. week, we're doing a benefit in, in uh, Pennsylvania. I think people can get tickets for that. Is that when is that? That's next Saturday. Saturday. Bobby. Bobby. Not this Saturday. Bobby. Not this Saturday. Bobby. Bobby. No. But not this Bobby. one. Not this Saturday. I'm there. Next Saturday. I'm there. It'll be a problem. I'm there, you buddy. cancel. It's in Pennsylvania. Well, we'll post it because I don't have the information. You don't have it. Oh, yeah. Benefit gig. Bobby doesn't have it on his Me, site, Scopo, so. and, and Bobby in Pennsylvania doing this yeah, benefit. Yeah, I mean you guys out there, right? Yeah, yeah I would assume so. Yeah. You know, and yeah. go to, uh, obviously, check out Legion of Sands and Anthony Kumia yeah. The Real Ass Podcast on the brand new Gas Digital Network and the Countdown every Thursday, right. 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Sirius XM. What are you fucking reading? I forgot something, Bobby. Can I yeah, go Yeah, what, in talking time? into the microphone? Yeah. Can you please p push the mic up? Sorry. See how the Argentinian guy's doing it? Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I, ha I have a podcast now with Gino Bisconti. It's called In Hot Water. Yeah. And oh, it's man. very enjoyable. Yeah. The working title is what, Two Hacks in a Tub. No, we're going to call it Old is that Hacks, what you but yeah. Is that what you feel like? Somebody's pouring hot water in your head? No, we we're going to do it in a hot tub, but then we decided not to because the noise. Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the noise meeting Gino. Uh, this is really the most. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, that guy. Yeah, no shit. Love him to pieces, but yeah. Lord Almighty. Actually, last time he was on the show was three years ago, and I, I will never. Too and loud. I, I shut the. Fu I, kept, I shut his mic off. Really? I kept shutting it uh, off. <laughs> I was like, "Fuck you." The thing <laughs> with Eisenhower is. And then I yeah. fucking I will n not. Not in a million years would I have him back on. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. We'll see the the self-driving cars first. Go ahead. All right. Uh, my April's kind of blocked out. I'm in Melbourne Festival. I don't know if you got any yeah. Australian. Yeah. Dishes. What is that? Uh, what's it when? Yeah. April. Is that just for laughs? Uh, April, Melbourne Comedy Fest. Cool. That's a April great festival. April or something, and then say hi to Kelly. Yeah, she's, she's probably she's hawking already, a one-woman show. Oh, she hit you up trying to get her on, on the up. show. She hit you yeah. up. I already hit me up. Oh, Are you on? She, did you put her on? No. <laughs> but uh, oh boy, hello, Mark. Have to Jimmy dig Jimmy out of that hole, Mark, right? Hello, because she doesn't even have the advantage of having an accent. Like hear that right. look to your advantage. <laughs> there is just she is what she is. Is droning uh, on for half an hour. I'll All say right, hi. What the fuck is this, I know fishes. Maybe banger? No. Did I? You? Maybe down there? No. Why Would not you? there? there. Tons of Australian She's horror. She's fucking. Yeah. Why would I pick yeah. the one? <laughs> the one that you knew. Yeah. yeah. I want you to yeah. fuck her in the butt and open up that fissure again. Yeah. Holy fissure. Yeah. So yeah. she'll lose it. weight. You opened it. Come on, let's go. All right. Then I'm in May. I'm at Zany's in Nashville. Yeah. Uh, I'm at uh, the Funny Bone in Newport, and uh, the Comedy Mix in Vancouver in the end of May. And yeah. follow me on Twitter at Mark Norm and listen to Tuesdays with Stories with me and Joe List. Who doesn't want kids ever? By the way, weird. Show I didn't list. want kids at all. Never wanted them. And then one fucking rainy day, I was like, "She went. You want kids?" And I was like, "Yeah, I think I do." Damn. <laughs> so that yeah. you guys tried for a while too. Well, yeah, we didn't want. I mean, she didn't want kids. We used to go on vacation and go look at like those people with kids. Yeah. And be like, Ugh. Yeah. Yeah, I, I didn't care about kids we, at all until I had them. Now I love kids. We we stayed in a hotel. We would stay in these. Ki we would stay in no ho kids hotels. Mm -hmm. ah. Like we would look for because we want those fucks mm. near us. And then one time she she booked a hotel. It was, it was an a, all kids hotel. It was a lot of kids and families. I mean, I was fucking miserable, miserable. 
I remember when I was in the jacuzzi. Because <laughs> they're too honest. And they the fucking kids. just came up to me and they were just like, hey. And I was like, get the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you're fat. Hey, hey, what are you doing? <laughs> I wasn't fat then. Oh. Well, I didn't know. We have to, if a joke isn't real, we have to say it. Oh. Right? Yeah. Well, that's the thing now, right? Well, well, I see you kept on, kept on slamming at home. Oh, whatever. Maybe someday you'll make enough money to go on vacation. Oh! <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm boning this girl now with an IUD. I'm jizzing all in there. It's amazing. Yeah. Oh, it's the best. Jizzing coming in there is the best. Coming the best. inside is the best. The best. Coming inside when you're married and it's another girl is the best. <laughs> <laughs> That's the best. Oh, just go. jizzing in a fucking new vag. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just uh, so good, dude. Wow, just so much cum yeah. it comes out of her asshole. Some guys like, are afraid yeah. of it. Some guys are fr- like, they're like, no, dude, that, I it freaks me out. I, was I, was I love first, shooting a bunch of Maxes in there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's the best. I don't yeah. get to do I pull out now. I like seeing it, too. That's also yeah. fun shooting it, it all over the place. It doesn't feel as good pulling out. I don't know. There's out. nothing like coming and not, like, not seeing it. Yeah. No. The other thing is the terrible when she gets up and it drips out. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. Cool. Then it becomes it's her gross. problem. Though. I like that. If I shoot it all over the place, i got to get her a towel yeah. and help yeah. her clean oh, up. If it's your if bed, it's your it, problem. If I shoot it inside of her, she has yeah. to get up and hold her pussy like cup. Come on, you, you slob. Yeah. She runs yeah. over there. Go get it on me. Get away. Get away. shoots it out of her pussy into the toilet. You hear her queef. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was my pussy, not my asshole. Yeah. Uh, I love a queef. I love making a girl queef. I hate that. I'm an inside. I love it. The vagina's talking to you. Ugh, fuck, I hate that. Just her fucking. I big came the other day pussy. and it made the New York, New York logo. Like, that's how much cum yeah. came out. I, I try to draw a swastika every time I come. <laughs> well, let's end on a bomb. Nope, Lauren left. Lauren left. Lauren, Lauren left. Lauren, did you laugh? Lauren left. Well, no, you're taking you it. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're getting the fuck out of here. You guys have been the best ever. Go to my uh, dates. You Real have... quick. I, I do, I got one. Oh, I'm sorry. April 23rd, 2016, the Renaissance Theater in Kingsport, Tennessee. Yeah. Go right now. Where is that? On my website, right? Go to robertkillerlive.com. Next week, I have the benefit with these two fucking eggheads. And then uh, and then uh, read that again. When is it? Uh, April 23rd, uh, Renaissance Theater, Kingsport, Tennessee. I got some dates, by the way. Uh, okay. Let me get through my... Oh, then we're going right to you. Uh, let's go to you first. You go. I got uh, this weekend. I'm with Dan Soder at the brokerage. So if you're listening, Ooh, you're listening fun, live... Fun room. Come check that out. And then next Thursday, I'm at Harris with Andrew Schultz. What's that noise? It's Lewis. It's Lewis. Oh, Lewis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What are you, on the phone? Yeah. What are you, fucking ass? The show's not over. Sit down. It's not over. It's not over. You said it was over. No, it isn't. I'm still talking. <laughs> fucking asshole. <laughs> Go ahead. Okay. Um, if you want to send anything to the studio, send it to YKWD Podcast or Robert Kelly at 117 McDougal Street, New York 10012. And send us your dick pics. Or pussy pics or, or tit pics. Or tit pics at producer at riotcast.com. Uh, don't, don't send more dick pics to me. You send them to the producer at Riotcast. Yeah, we I discussed want, this last time on the show. There's nothing funny about pussy or I want all the They dick sent dick us dick pics. You yeah. want to see dick them? Yeah, yeah. let's see them. I want all the dicks. I want to right. see the pussies, too. She's got them. All right, so listen, here's the thing. Uh, go to uh, robertkellylive.com for all my dates. Um, what do I want to say? Um, I think that's it, dude. No, that's also, it. on May 22nd, we're going to be doing a pod fest. And oh, yeah. Yes. We're so. doing a big show. Lewis, you're on it, right? Pod fest. Yeah, yes. doing it, yeah. We're May doing uh, me, Dan, Joe, Lewis on pod fest. Uh, it's going to be amazing. Uh, so make sure you get your tickets. How do they get them? Um, the, everything's up on our Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Um, or you can um, go to New York NYC Podfest on Twitter, and they have everything there. Or yeah, com. Get your tickets now. It's a small venue. Let's fucking get this sold out and done with. Uh, you guys are the best. What else we got? Anything else? That's it. All right, you guys are the best fans in the world. Thanks for listening to my show. Thanks for following all these fucks on their uh, Twitter and Instagram. Go to this show's live. Please support live comedy. Tell them you heard them from uh, this show right here. I'll see you guys next week. You know what, dude? Bye. You've been listening to the YKWD podcast. Thanks for listening. Now go back to your shitty jobs. Shitty jobs. Check out riotcast.com for all of the best podcasts on the internet. And they're all free. And they're all free.